this this music is from Oblivion, and I I miss Oblivion. I miss Morrowind. I miss Oblivion. I wish I could play Morrowind, Oblivion, and Skyrim all at once, but sadly I cannot. We are here today for Skyrim and Skyrim alone. The time will come where I play uh, Morrowind and then Oblivion a second time. I think by the time I get round to those, it'll be the uh, it'll be like for a full play. I mean, I'm going, coming back to Morrowind to look at the Tamriel rebuilt mod, but for a big playthrough, the next time will be the darkest timeline playthrough where I play like an asshole. But uh, we'll see. It's been raining all day. It's the space. Uh, the road in front of your house has become a lake. You should put some rubber ducks out there. <laughs> yeah. I hope you've got some Wellington boots to put on if you need to, if you need to leave the house. Um, and hopefully any food deliveries you've got have no trouble getting through um, as well. Sounds like something must be clogged. Although you say that, it's not quite out the front of me, but down the road, the road that I walk along to get to my supermarket, um, someone's doing some... They're like renovating their entire front yard. I don't know what they're going to turn it into, whether it's going to be a driveway or whatever. But there's like loads of dirt piled up. And that is, is clogged up with loads of water. And it's like there's like a miniature lake right, like right next to the pavement. I don't know what they're doing, but it seems like a real inconvenience. You planned ahead. Your food delivery was on Wednesday. Aha! Nice. You, you, <laughs> your rain sense was tingling. And there it was. Um, hello, Eddie, by the way. And thank you for the like. Hello, Space. And hello, Vicky. Hello, Vicky. How you doing? Hi. <laughs> hi, hi, hi. Mm. Oh, I have perfected this coffee. Um, right. Apologies as much as I love Oblivion. It's time to put the music to rest and run the game. Here we go, baby. You're back. Already, Eddie. Already, Eddie. All Eddie. What'd you do? Just stick your head under the shower and then leave? It's not... Come on. What the hell do you think you're doing? Uh... I'm good, thank you, Vicky. Um, I, I, I mean, I, I, I hesitate to say that I'm feeling better than I was yesterday. Again, yesterday I wasn't unwell, I was just tired. So I'm well rested and a lot better today. Um, and groceries have been done, lots of yummy things obtained. And uh, come on, game, what are you doing? Okay, good. Bloody hell. The whole game is going wrong, as you can see. That shouldn't look like that. And it also shifted my sc Whoa! What? Um... Uh... Um... I don't think it's meant to look like this. What happens if I just say continued? Will it just reboot it or something? Oh god. <laughs> it has gone crazy. And like three different music tracks are like, oh my god. All of a sudden, what did I do? Nothing! Literally nothing. I haven't touched the setup since last week. And even, well, even, la even last week I didn't, I didn't change anything. I just haven't touched anything. Turn it off and on again. Yeah, I might have to. If the game is unplayable, I think I might. It, it didn't... Um, the game didn't pop up properly, so... It might be to do with that. Oh my god. I think it might be to do the re with the resolution. The resolution is fucked. I didn't change that. Right. Uh, no. Display. No, come on. I want to change... The... Why can't I change the resolution? The hell? How is there not a setting for... For, um, resolution? Uh... 
Yeah, I think I think I'll I'll do as you suggested, Vicky, and I will quit and then. Okay, very strange. Let's go back to Gex <laughs> and finish it. Finish it off. Sorry, what did you say about you didn't wash your hair because you did yesterday and you want to wash it tomorrow because then I'm going out with family. I was just showering in case because I want because you went out with some tennis a little, a little ago. Okay. I'll F4. Oh, well, I've already quit it now, so. Yeah. Um, nothing's different. It's the same mods, the same versions. Um, nothing should have updated automatically. Um, yeah, the last thing I installed was uh, the Merlin mod, which is number 69 in the priority list. Nice. Um, Skyrim script extender, yeah. I don't get why I couldn't change the resolution, though. Was I missing something? Shouldn't it be in the game? Hello, Simi. Bo -bo 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 -bo. <laughs> ah. Yeah, Merlin the Magical Corgi. Or Corgicus Magicus, as uh, Eve likes to call him. How you doing, Simi? Um. Okay, let's just try and boot the game up again. Run. You play Minecraft, Vicky. Oh, nice. Well, you're welcome to join the um, multiplayer server, Herdcraft. It's a bit quiet at the moment, though, because most people are waiting for 1.20, but you're welcome to join for when 1.20 comes. This is better. It's already better. It must have just glitched upon opening. Um, you're doing all right baking a cake. <gasps> if I knew you were coming out of baked a cake. What cake are you baking, Cindy? This is a lot better. I think it's fixed. It was just doing hashtag Bethesda things. You can't join multiplayer, your Xbox won't let you. Oh no, really? That's a shame, because um, the server supports Bedrock users, which includes uh, PS and Xbox players. But if it's not letting you join, that's, that's a bit fucked. Sag. Victoria Sponge Cake. Oh, I, do like I do like that. I do like that. I do like that cake. Uh, sure, okay. Just FYI, I don't give a rat's ass about that event. I'm not going to bring it into my stream. That is all I will say on the matter. Okay. I need to build... I need to make a building list of things that I need. I like any cake. That is true. Cake is good. I can drool at any cake I wish, and it just so happens that Victoria Sponge Cake was mentioned, therefore I will drool over it. Right, I need three goat horns. Three horny goats. I need a hinge, but not the dating app. I need two hinges, but not two dating apps. I need three hinges, but not three dating apps. Okay. Cool. Not bad. Not bad at all. I make this for the... Kremlin. What? You got raspberry jam and cream in the fridge, so you took your chance. Oh, yeah. Oh, yep. Yeah. Same, Vicky. Same. And I'm glad we're on the same wavelength there. Yeah, I did think about setting up some kind of bot that would um, detect the phrase and answer for me, so that I don't even have to say that I don't want to respond to it. But um, I, did, I don't know how to do that, because I am not a clever... I'm not a clever TM... Right, this one's been done. I think I think it's only that back room at the top and the basement that I need to build things for. Everything else is done. And the reason I'm the reason I'm moving so slowly is because I'm fat and lazy. And in game, the reason I'm moving so slowly is because I'm carrying far too much stuff. I'm pretty sure this room is done. Yeah, and we have a full display of critters as well. I'm pretty sure two pieces of music are playing. Why... Why are there two ash piles in here? Sorry, one. Oh my god, can I not even... Okay, I can still get to the cellar. Okay.
Uh, I need, I need a, I need a separate amulet of Talos, because the one I've got is the one I need, for, like on me. I need two saber cat teeth, which is already in my shopping list from before. Clear out the stuff that I don't need. Boom, 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 boom. I need an RK as well. I need De Debella. Debella. Julianos. Or Julian is, as the autocorrect changed it to. Kinareth. I don't know where I can. Is there somewhere I can just buy these amulets from? I thought I had multiple spares, but I checked at the safe house at the museum, and I don't. Oh, unless I dumped them all in the jewellery cabinet at the gallery. Maybe I need to look there. Right, good. And that's the only workbench for the basement, so... At least I think it is. Let me run over here and see. Did I manage to get some good rest last night? I did indeed, and I even had a 45-minute nap earlier. That was so good that I, um, wait, what's this? Oh my god, fish tanks! Oh, I can put the fishies in! Oh my god, oh my god, I need to get, I need to get fish. Large fish put here will be placed inside the fish tank. Oh, I need to go and catch some fish and carry them on my person and keep them alive somehow and then put them in the fish tanks here. Um, I guess I'll just... Just go fishing at some point. Ooh. <laughs> so I wear my fishing clothes while I do it. <laughs> Gone fishing. Catching them with my bare hands. If I go to the clothing shop in Solitude, they usually sell amulets. Okay, thank you, Vicky. I will have a look. Oh, oh what? Uh, was it Radiant Raiment? I think it is. I will have a look. Whoops. Oh yeah, Eddie, this has been going on for over a year now. Um, I think I started playing in March uh, 2022. But, um, yeah, most of the quests that I've got are modded. This is from a mod. This is from a mod. This is from the mod. These are all from the same mod. Arniel's Endeavour is a vanilla side quest. That is the main quest, which I am not prepared to do just yet. I want to make this the very last thing that I do. Um, defeating Alduin, I mean. So, Alduin's just been chilling at um, Sovngarde this whole time. <laughs> I haven't even got the Odavin shout yet. Um, these are ongoing side quests. I will soon be ready to do this. But at the moment, I'm finishing Lakeview Manor, doing, like, odd jobs. Um, yeah, I'm... Um, Definitely, like, I don't know, three quarters of the way through what I, what I want to do in the game. Hello, Katie. New haircut guy. Yeah, I, 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 I balked up my own haircut. So, yeah. I have got it. I've got it short again. And next time, it will be to... Oh, you know what? I'm going to put my building materials in here. Uh, or will I? No, I don't know. I'll put it outside in the main chest. How you doing, Katie? How was how's your day been since um, the rescuers this morning? napped again. Yeah, I also napped. Mine was like post-food nap. The best naps. Okay. Oh, the cow! What's happened to the cow? Oh, no. The cow is stuck. Sorry, I'm gonna... Let's move faster. The sun is... It's not great for my skin. Shut up. Oh, my God. I didn't even... I need, the, I need the goat horns, and I need the saber cat teeth. 
But what I can make is the three hinges. There we go. Ah, uh, oh, smithing 69. Boom. Uh, I'm going to dump. Oh, I should have seen what materials I needed. Let me get rid of the stuff that I know I won't need for whatever I'm going to build. I don't need clay. I won't need... Oh, thank you for the bits, Katie. 69 bits. You have this health, co health coach thing where you have to weigh in every day. Wasn't happy. Went back to bed so I could pee more. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, I mean... I don't like weighing myself every day. And I don't think weighing yourself every day is very good because... You, you won't see the change as significantly as if you checked, like, weekly. But I know some people feel like they're in control more if they weigh daily. I think it just depends on how you feel about it. I, um... I check weekly. Um, although I th I'm, I'm pretty sure I will have gained since last week because I was away and also ate quite a bit when I was away. So... Mm. Oh, God, I've got all these... All these gems and stuff to uh, display. Uh, excuse me. I'm not sure how many of these pelts I need. I don't. I don't think I need bear pelt, or cave bear pelt, or elk hides. I know I need something that has goats, so I might keep the goat hide on me. I don't need that, and I don't need that, and I don't need that. I will keep the hinges and all the metal stuff. I will put the ingots away. Yeah, those are the those are eight of the Dwemer cogs that I was supposed to use for Arniel's endeavor, but I've done it now, so put those away. Okay, that's enough for now. I'll go and finish building those two bits and then leave again. You object to it daily as well. It naturally fluctuates and that drives me nuts. Yeah. Gotta get fit to Galavan across Europe in full. <laughs> Hoping to return to the, to the UK this year. Ah! Oh, oh, sorry. You mean next year? Yes. Do it. Do it. You've got a new policy at work where you can buy more holiday time. Oh, I see. Can't they just give it you? Yeah? Buying extra holiday. Ugh. You get more time off, but we'll pay you less. What can't what, what, what can I have both? Okay, tall wardrobe. Done. Uh, I put the glass away. Uh, I fucking knew this would happen. I left the glass outside, and that means that I can't finish building that one thing. They're cheapos. Oh, okay, well... Yeah, okay, fine. As long as it's not like taking, like cutting a big dent out of your, out of your income. Here we go, glass. I don't, I don't think we can buy more holiday, for my job. I've never thought about it. I'm just happy with what I've got. I get my weekends off. I get, I think, I think I get a generous portion of annual leave. There we go. Um, it does want an iron ingot as well, but I've got that in the chest outside. It's the goat horns that I need. So, I no longer need the hinges. Okay. Literally just the saber cat teeth, the amulets, the goat horns, and that's it. That will finish Lakeview Manor. Please get out of the way! Thank you. <laughs> you have to be there eight years to get a third week off. Ah, okay. Oh, is he float? Yep. The amazing floating gold ear. Okay. I am putting away that. That. I'm going to keep the gems on me. Goat hide, hinge, iron fittings, nails, amber. All of these.
yeah, I need a hell of a lot more Falmer in Falma fragments for one of the quests that I'm doing. And I have found that there are a couple of sites at Darkwater Pass that I might be able to go back to. Otherwise, most of the Falmer dig sites are in the Forgotten Vale, which is which makes sense considering the amount of Snow Elf history that's there. But that's also convenient because that is right near where I need to bring them to anyway. Um, but I am going to check the um, gallery as well when I pass it. Hmm. I'm not sure I need the dragon bone or dragon scales right now. Hello, Venomane. Change it to be a fourth week at 12 years and not 15. So that's me next year, I think. But that's your sixth time and all of it. Ah, oh, I see. Okay. There is always a snag. Um, okay. I let's, let's assess where I need to go. Let's remove the custom marker. I've got to go over here and get a staff and that will take me back to Arniel Gain over here um, yep that I can't do yet oh yeah Dawnstar Sanctuary I need to go yeah I really hope it doesn't ask it doesn't want me to go inside the sanctuary because I can't go in there it's broken if I get there and I can't go in. I'm hoping that it's just going to be outside the sanctuary somewhere. Alright, so we'll come back to Lakeview Manor later. For now, we are going to head this way. Come along, gang. Sarah! That's not what this is for. You know that, don't you? What happens if I... Let me just fix you up real quick. <laughs> There you go. Feeling better? No? Okay, let me try here. Okay, how's that? Merlin, how's her feet doing? Good, okay. Alright, I think you'll be fine. Let's go. Sorry, my slippers keep slipping off. Is that why they is that why they're called slippers? Because they slip off your foot really easily. Wouldn't be surprised. Ooh, hello. Kinnereth has chosen a beast for me to slay. Oh, it fucking turned away! Get him! Ugh. You little... Oh, come here. Come here. Motherfucker. Someone play the Benny Hill music. <laughs> Oh, I fucking lost it. Where's it gone? I'll... I'll deal with those bandits in rain. Oh, no, there it is. There we go. Kindest piece of actions. Thank you. Right. Hello there. And just them left. Oh, he'll be dead soon. Hmm. Oh, they're fighting again. Got any loot? What's that? 
black mage robes. Oh. Wait, what? Oh, okay. The, uh, the zombie spoke with a normal voice instead of going... Ugh. Okay, that'll do. Let's be on our way. Oh, there's also a little bit of, um, um, I tried, so again, you know how the same ambient music has been playing on loop, and I, th I think it started ever since I did The Forgotten City. Well, I did another look to try and find a fix for that, and I found a post that was mentioning that mod, and they said, if you go into the Forgotten City entrance and then leave again, it might fix it. So that is all the way over here somewhere. Uh, there you go, it's there. So after I've been around the map on another loop, I'll stop off here and see if I can sort that out. Because I, I don't tend to notice that much, but I would like to listen to the original music every so often, you know? Right, catch some fish. Fishy, fishy! Just spam the A button. I got a salmon and a salmon row. Oh, never mind. Two fish. That oh, another salmon. Ah, I'm gonna put the fishies in my brook bass. I'm gonna put the fishies in my fish tank. Um, I want to try and get a different. I want to try and get a range. You know, I could try fishing for them, couldn't I? Maybe that's what you're meant to do. Go fishing and actually catch them. Hello, Gweg. Uh, can't hear or stop by for long because you're out, but I just wanted to wish you well and say I hope you're feeling better today. Oh, thank you, Greg. Yeah, I'm feeling... I mean, again, you can't hear me. But I'm feeling fine. I was just tired yesterday. Very sleepy. And now I am awake. <laughs> Oh, oh, that's better. Oh, I think that was, I think that bunged up my systems. It was preventing me from being awake. I don't want brook bass. Give me, give me other fish. Cake is in the oven now. Damn, the cake. Oh, sure, Sharanya. Sure, yeah, they do. You're talking. You're thinking about Windhelm. You're thinking only in Windhelm. New to Riverwood? If you're looking for work. Go see Hod at the mill. Hod. Hod, 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 Hod. Oh, I can see if I can get goat horns from here as I'm passing, can't I? The Riverwood Trader. Ha <laughs> ha! <laughs> Gib. Hello, mate. Thank you so much for taking care of those thieves. The Riverwood Trader is back to the way it used to be. Cool. Trinkets, odds and ends, that sort of thing. <laughs> do you have... You do have goat horns. And I need... What was it I needed? Was it three? Or was it just the one set? Three goat horns. I would like three, please. Thank you. Shopping list. Tick. Does he have saber cat teeth? No. Your store is rubbish. I'm never coming here again, but I will buy these off you. Uh, and these. Alright. Until next time. Until next time, friends. Hello, Eddie. You hate shaving so goddamn badly. Uh, if you... I mean, I imagine... You're, you're, I imagine you'll have to pay for it, but you could um, get your chin lasered. Is that how it works? To stop hair from growing back? I only hate shaving because what I have to get to, to, to get rid of is just so pathetic and flimsy. Like, I'd love to be able to grow a full beard, but I can't. And it sucks. 
because it's like, well, then what's the point? I, I either want a beard or nothing at all. Nothing at all. Nothing at all. Nothing at all. <laughs> um, oh, yeah, I'm meant to be catching, catching more fish, aren't I? Here, fishy, fishy, fishy. Mm. Oh, hello. <laughs> hello there. Which one are you? You're a brook bass. Boring. Boring. Fish, 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 fish. Whoa! <laughs> salmon. I've already got salmon. Oh, hello. Hello. Yes, yes. You're all very interesting, I'm sure, but you're not what I need right now. Maybe I should go out to sea and find some fish there. I'm starting to think I should use... Oh my god, imagine doing an aquatic playthrough where you only travel via the waterways. At, like, rivers and lakes and stuff. I don't think, I don't think that'd work out too well. You'd have to keep getting on land for stuff, but... Like, say I, say I wanted to get to Windhelm. I would have to use the, the waterways to get there, kind of thing. Pay, screw that. Pop front panel on DVD drive. Set that bad boy to 28 times speed, right? Oh, okay. You've been seeing lots of ads for safety razors recently. Even though they literally have safe in the name, it would slightly scare me still. Oh, I see. So it's that that's, um, that bothers you. Okay. Um. Yeah, I don't really know of an alternative, really. Apart from like, Nyeh, but that hurts. Oh, shall I go fishing? I must have a fishing rod equipped. Fuck! Guess I'm catching them all by hand. Wee! I mean, this is the way we're going anyway, isn't it? Oh yeah, look, we're nearly there. Uh, I do need to be on this side of the water though, so. Oh, hello. Saber cat. <gasps> Saber cat. I can get Saber cat teeth, maybe. Oh my god, he just... <gasps> it disappeared into the water. You're going to drown at this rate, mate. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Oh, there you are. Um. Oh, fucking hell. Fine, we'll get you the old-fashioned way. No. An eye, a pelt. I need the teeth! Uh, look! Look at those pearly whites right there. I can't even yank them out. Game said no. Oh my god, slaughterfish versus crabs. Who will win? I think the crabs are going to win. Yeah. Mud crabs win. Because of course they did. The legendary mud crab. Griffin says hi. Hello, Griffin. Oh, another one. Come on. Oh my god, I think it's got infants as well. Yay! One tooth. And I need one more. Okay. Kill the little one! Yep, we got it. Sarana once again using the mother to slay the child. Very grim, very grim indeed. Facial hair so smelly. Uh, again, mine, mine doesn't grow full enough to really smell of anything. Laser da beard. <laughs> I'm a fire in my laser. Uh, do what Superman does, Eddie, and use your laser eyes to in a mirror and aim it at your chin. Griffin blobbed to the hallway to watch you bake. I'm waiting for the time to attack feet. Oh. <laughs> Computer says no. Yeah, exactly. Now what's this all about? Oh, hello. This. It, uh, it's got a shrine of Talos, but I need... 
the amulet of Talos. Oh my god, Torig's Warhorn. This goes in the gallery, but I feel like it'd be a bit rude for me to just take it and... Because I, I put it here for a quest for um, Queen Elisif. Um, and I am loyal to Solitude, so I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna... No, no, I'm not, I'm not gonna t I'm not gonna desecrate this place. I'm gonna leave it as it found it. There are plenty of other amulets out there. Let me just turn on my laser eyes. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> the circle of life. Ah. Uh. Oh, I see. Put the DVD right a laser in the mirror. <laughs> wow. Wow. Sheesh. Here we are. This is where the staff is. Right, uh, this is the staff, please. Come out with your hands up and grasp your staff firmly and wave it in front of me so that I know you have it. So it is treason then. A shame. Oh, here we go. I mean, they've got my back. To, they've got their back to me. It, I mean, it, it makes sense, doesn't it? If an enemy has their back to you and they're on a high precipice, you do this. <laughs> Wee! <laughs> and then they die because they take fall damage a lot more than others do. The only time people use DVDs is for like console game discs. They practically don't exist anymore. I mean... You are right. I, I, I've still got a load of DVDs that I want to try and get rid of because they just don't get used anymore. Oh, Chicken died. And it's... <laughs> face down, ass up. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Serana wants chicken nuggets for dinner. <laughs> She's after them chicken nuggies. We've been here before. I can't remember what quest this um, this place is for, but yeah. I wonder if anyone's light scribed a beard before. Uh, probably. I think I think it's probably happened. Oh, and there's a chicken's nest. <laughs> that chicken was two days from retirement. <laughs> Face down, ass up. I was trying to think of like a, a second bit to um, rhyme it with, but I couldn't think quickly enough. And movies as well, yeah. Quote 1388. Rotate to the butterfly, lick the door. Rotate to the bear, lick the door. Lick the door. Oh, was I meant to be saying pick, as in lock, pick the lock? Right, what am I here for? Oh yeah, the staff. <laughs> I have no memory of this place. But that's what the quest marker's for. The Dungians are in there. Healing potion? Yep. Face down, ass up, park bike. <laughs> wow. No! Oh no, I missed! Get him, Merlin! But don't stand in my way, because then I'll end up shooting you by accident. There we go. I have to remember to get all my potions back from the gallery as well. Because, like an idiot, I hit the sorting chest and it took away all my potions. Hmm. I can't search this ash pile. Okay, never mind. Ooh. Free ingots. Wait, where's... Where's the staff in relation to where I am? 
same. Ah, shit. what the fuck is happening with my cam? With my cam? That's as bright as I can get it, and I'm still half in shadow. There's there's still one more ring light that I hope to get, and I'm gonna put that behind this monitor if I can, so that it's looking down upon me. Um. And that should solve my lighting issues. One would hope. It probably isn't going to work out that way. Because my setup gets more janky with every quote-unquote upgrade. How did he not know I was here? Dude! You were literally facing the door that I came in, that I came through. Boom. A book. Ooh, do I need the card of spiders? Valen stood so perfectly still that he was invisible. <laughs> Best gag from... Infinity War. Uh, I do need the Seven of Spiders. Yay! I'll take the painting as well. Uh, I still need the Five and the Nine of Spiders. So many shadowy corners to strike from. I could learn to like this place. <laughs> uh, oh no, I don't want those. Never mind. Staff of Tandil. Is that the one I need? Yes, it is good. Should have thought as much because it was the named staff. Well, there's no need to go any further. I may as well just go out the way I came in. Come along, everyone. Ta-da! Right. Um, I don't need to go to Windhelm for anything, so it is just straight up north to Winterhold. Let's be on our way. Oh, wait, no. Where's Darkfall, Darkwater Crossing, or whatever it's called? There. Uh, it's a little bit out of the way. I'm going to go there and excavate the Falmer dig sites that are there. And I'll have a few more fragments to make the... I have to make a... a what is it? A, a Trinimac artifact thing? And it needs like 50 Falma fragments. Um, it probably needs keystones as well, but I don't know how many keystones I need. Aha! Whee! <laughs> that will never not be fun. Oh, hello. Bye! Oh, I just... I could loot him. Too late. This won't end well for you, says Serana, collapsing on the stairs. You... you sure showed them, Serana. Boy. Aren't you a tough one. Oh. Ooh, iron. Can't use it while in combat. Ugh. 
Um... Oh yeah, I need to go... Why are they still shooting at me? They can't get to me. Serana, you sausage. Yeah. You should have seen her earlier. Valand was... Uh, she was sitting on the on the um, workbench. And Valand was just, like, hammering away. That sounds ruder than it, than it is. Ooh, meteorite. Oh. Oh, we got them. Okay, well done, whoever did that. Right, now I can... yep. There we go. Lovely. I don't actually think I need iron anymore. In fact, I think I, think, I, think I can stop looking for building materials overall. Everything I need is uh, I need I need I need one more saber cat tooth, and then the amulets, and that's it. I think everything else I've already got handy. But you know what they say: better safe than sorry. Oh dear. Huh. Ooh. Loads of horrible things, probably. Oh, a goat. Oh, if if the well where kills the goat. Oh, it won't. Oh, maybe running away. Okay then. Oh. Beer news. I got my beer 52 through yesterday with 10 beers in instead of the usual 8, which was a nice surprise. It has increased in price by £3 per month. I don't know if that's the norm now or if they put in 10 to be like, sorry, we're increasing the prices. So I don't know. But yeah, that'll last me. 10 streams or so. I'll have one later. Okay. Uh oh, giant camp. I don't think I've ever in this playthrough, been yeeted into the air by a giant. It might have happened at some point. You're not getting the best of me. But I don't remember it. If it did happen, I don't. I don't think it was clipped because I would have um, come across it for editing the Skyrim video, which I need to do more of. Didn't get to do it last week because of I was because of me being away. in the buttock. Okay. I don't think we're that much... I don't think we've got that much to go, that much further to go now. 
I should get over to Windhelm more. See how the other Morrowind refugees are getting along. Aww. Aranya is a example of a nice Daedra worshipper, not one of the weird ones. Yep, that is it. Darkwater Crossing. It's a mine on the map. And then I'll head north to get to uh, Winterhold. Oh, a little bit melancholy coming back here. This is where we rescued Durkithus from. And he's the one companion who has canonically died in the playthrough. <sighs> because that was before I had the Friendly Fire mod installed. So he either got caught in the crossfire or he genuinely died. I don't, I don't know. Either way, he's no longer with us. Oh, hang on, no, this is the mine. I actually need to go there. Right, because it's Darkwater Crossing and then Darkwater Pass. Hmm. <laughs> Hi, Merlin. Uh oh. Are you angry? Oh no, you seem. Uh oh. <laughs> An ogre! Look, if you leave me alone, I'll leave you alone. Alright? Oh no, here we go. Just as he's died. Sorry, space. Um, okay. Jazz. Okay. You like jazz? This will mean having to navigate around my green screen. Jazz, my beloved. Oops. Okay, so, lessons learned from yesterday. Elbows on the table so that my hands don't die. Um, okay. I think this will work, but we'll see. Um, I did the jazz unboxing the day before I went away for Christmas, didn't I? Wow. All that time ago. Such a cool figure, though. So well done. Okay. Um, no, nope, can't pull you apart yet. Got to do this first. Uh... 
Oops. See, that's the benefit of having this uh, light box here now. It'll catch anything that falls off. Or pings off, or whichever. Oh, come on, why are you... Oh. Yeah, that's, that's what I wanted to do, but fine. these bits. Uh, this bit right here up in the shoulder. Can I even get it out? Mm. There we go. And there's one on this side as well. in and down same on this side Good. We're almost done with the upper body. You just realised you may have to break, make the rest of the cake tomorrow. It needs to cool before adding the cream and the sugar on top. And you don't have one of those blast freezers, so the fridge takes time. <laughs> oh no, I didn't, I didn't realise that. But there you go, it's giving you something to do tomorrow at least. Uh, right. Now I have to sort the legs out. Mm. Okay, oh, I need to rotate this whole assembly around. I, I, I really want to make more tiffin and have a go at making some different brownies, but, you know, what with dieting and then also budgeting, I just it just hasn't been justifiable yet. Soon. Soon. It'll happen. I'm also hesitant to do any more cooking streams because the chat might scream at me again like it did with the burritos. There is a leg. Now I must give him another leg. Good. 
Mm-hmm. Then you need to fold up in there. the uh, things back on his back. Um, okay. And then... Oops. Give him his rifle to hold. If I can get his hands open. There we have Jazz. God, I've really shifted this around, haven't I? <laughs> Fucking hell. I need a bigger table. Um, there we are. What a good lad. And again, there's me on the horse cart playing the accordion. The design is neat. It really is. Um, fans toys are good at that. Um, it really is accurate to that animation look. And not too untidy on the back in terms of the uh, robot mode either. Like the vehicle parts are all nice and neatly tucked away. He's good and weighty as well. He's got some good die-cast parts in there. There we go. Ugh. There have been other attempts at doing jazz from other third-party companies, but I think this one's the best. Right. On my way. Um, I think this is how you get to the. Oh yeah, it's up. It's up here. Okay. Come on, parkour. Let me up. Figures you have are okay, but the Zan is still quite cheap looking. Not so tidy like fans go fans toys. I mean, yeah, that's fans toys are not made for the general markets. Like they're not the kind of things that you could go to the local toy shop and buy for your buy for your kid. You know, that's where Hasbro, Hasbro and Takara they build it for wider markets. The fans' toy stuff is very much collector's items. So, yeah, you get higher quality, but you're going to be more out of pocket with it. And boy, was I out of pocket for it. <laughs> we'll need to watch our steps inside. But, I think a lot of the stuff that is being made for Rise of the Beasts looks really good. Like, the, the official Hasbro stuff, I mean. Like, um, the Scourge looks really cool. Um... I'm I'm very interested in picking them up for myself. However, there's two versions of Bumblebee. One is Studio Series and one is Official, and they're very similar, but the Studio Series one is the best because the other one just has just his feet poking out the back. We 
Uh oh. Okay, I'm gonna go back to. I'm gonna go to this. Not this, this. And then. this. Yeah, I can get fragments from family bodies as well, which is good. Hmm. Oh! Seen any elves? <laughs> I caught an Obesian longfin to put in my fish tank. I'm being munched by a thing. <laughs> Seen any elves? <laughs> I'm wee. So I've got to keep an eye out for Falmer dig sites. There's meant to be two in here. Yep, that's generally what a cave does, Aranya. You're very, very observant. Well done. I'm okay with the dark, but I've spent more than my share of time. She's never fucking happy, is she? Oh, I don't like being outside. It's not good for my skin. But then you go into a cave and she's like, I've spent more of my fair so, so, uh, inside the cave. Quit your belly aching for five minutes! <laughs> Thank you for the luck, Cinny. Uh, right, I think this is all... Oh, no, Cyrodiilic Spade Tail. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Yes. More fish and a hist carp. Yes. More fish for the fish tank. <laughs> More fish for the fish god. Let's have a look at what I've got so far. I think it counts as food, doesn't it? Brook bass. Two salmon. Obesian longfin. Cyrodiilic Spade Tail. Hist carp. Cool. Oh, salmon row. Oh! Uh, nom nom. Ooh, Zenatime Y. Oh, well, I mean, why not? Pop. <laughs> what the salmon row? Pop. Uh, right. Let's go this way. Ooh, a muck chest. Oh, donkey. <laughs> <laughs> Will you stop being yourself for five minutes? Come on, where are the dig sites? I can't have gone past them. They're pretty obvious when you come across them. Oh, this is where, um... This is where Dakitha's was all that time ago! <laughs> Ooh, a secret hole. <laughs> you work in that hat. <laughs> You're over here. Oh, that's good. I don't really care where you are. Oh, Dirkethus, this is where we found you! The Argonian working at the mine. Ooh, Darkwater Pit Key. And a Nordic Fragment, nice. Oh, Dirkethus, forever in our hearts. The one victim of the uh, Valand Adventures. I bet he's really pissed off about that as well. In the afterlife, he's like, Oh, now he installs the friendly fire mod. Well! <laughs> Ooh, hello. Mm. Okay, 
nothing else here. Ooh, what's this do? No. Oh, I did it too early! Yes, taste the Mora tentacles! Aha! There is a dig site. Um, I think the other one might be further back. Get digging. Five fragments and a keystone. Good. And that's it. Archaeology increased to 87. Okay, nice. So I reckon if I hit all the dig sites at the Forgotten Vale, I reckon that'll be enough for what I need. If we say it's five per dig site, then I only need to go to ten. But in fact, it'll be less than that because I already had 19 fragments on me already. Mm, I need to find dig site number two. Did you hear something? Oh, I see. You guys are trying to fight someone who's above us. <laughs> Quick maths! It will be once I um, rediscover what it is I need to make and what, and what I need to get for it. Go on, Millie. Oh. Good job, Millie. Um So that's this is this is the way out? Yeah. Um there is definitely two dig sites here. Um one is down there in the water. Where's the second one? to look up the uh, wiki again. Mm. Here we go. Dig Sites, Legacy of the Dragonborn wiki. Darkwater Pass, in a side room, on the lower level, 
next to an arcane enchanter. Okay, a side room on the lower level. The second one is near the top entrance in the first cavern at the base of the waterfall. That's the one that I can see there. Lower level next to an arcane enchanter. Okay, let's um, head back doom. Yeah, I had a look at that earlier. Side room. Side room. This is a side room, but I didn't see any arcade enchanter in here. Uh, oh! Uh, oh, wait, no, no, this is different. Oh! It's right here. Fuck's sake. Right. Diggy, diggy hole. See how many fragments I get from this one. Three... Another five. Looks like it is five per dig site then. Cool. Well, in that case, I should have nearly 25. Fragment Falma. 31. So less than 20 to get. And I don't know how many keystones I need, but... There they are. Right, now I can leave. We gotta get out of this place. And now we can go and speak to Arniel Gain. And find out what else he needs for his little experiment about the Dwemer. Dwemer, Dwemer, Dwarves, Deep Folk, Deep Ones, I don't know. When I saw uh, Guardians 3 yesterday, they played a trailer for The Little Mermaid in front of it. And I'm not a huge Disney movie fan, but I did get a little bit of goosebumps just because my sister used to watch Little Mermaid all the time. So it was like... Hearing the music, I'm familiar with it because of that, and it's kind of... It took me back some years, you know? And I thought it looked quite good. Is, is it Melissa McCarthy playing Ursula? That's right, isn't it? I, I, if so, very good casting. She looks great. Uh, already got one of you. Silverside Perch. Get a couple of those. Right, now I can get rid of this. And we head. We ride north! Ah! After I've fallen down this waterfall. <laughs> it's okay. I'm alright, I'm just a bit wet. Oh, hello. I spies a minotaur. I'm going to come and get you! <laughs> come on! Get him! He might, he might be carrying a saber cat tooth if he... I don't know, if he wrestled with one, maybe? Who's... Who the hell was hammering something just then? What the hell was that? Hi. Wait. You're a nice one. Come with me. He can follow us? Do I want you following us? Is this the one that was meant to be a pet from the pets mod and then it didn't work because... Um... Well, it just didn't work, did it? It kept spawning in a mammoth, I think. Nah. Nah. I need to reduce the amount of followers I have, not... Uh-oh. 
It's a frozen. You can't even see my controller. There it is. What? Oh no! I mean, thankfully, it will have saved when we left Darkwater Cave, so. Yeah. Alt F4 did nothing. Yeah, tabbing out hasn't done anything. Task manager. And I will move it over here so I can see it. Yeah, Skyrim not responding, Sag. Okay. Well, it closed quickly. Mm. Okay. Run. Come on. There we go. At least I can get back into the game quickly. Yay, vanilla Skyrim music. Oh my god, what if it's suddenly fixed? That'd be good. Oh. <laughs> it stopped. Yep, here we go. Not bad at all. No. There we go. Now let's be on our way. And no messing about in the waterfalls this time. Oh no! The, the fish! The fish! I caught some fish last time. River Betty. Abyssian Longfin. There we go. And... Histcart. Silverside Perch. That's enough fish to, to be getting on with at the moment. Then when I swing around to Lakeview Manor, I'll put some fish in the fish tanks. It's a nice idea. It must be the, um, sp uh, the special edition that added that. I don't think it's from a mod, because the special edition had the fishing with it. That's a really nice idea. I wasn't expecting it. Although I should have paid more attention to the things I was making, because I would have crafted the fish tanks when I built the basement. Ah, look at that. Windhelm down there. Nope, sorry, Windhelm is over there, actually, isn't it? Yeah. But we're not going there, we're going behind it to... Winterhold. Nailed it. Ooh, what are you? Brook Bass, already got one of you.
Hmm. Aha. Hello there. I need your tooth. Oh. No, god damn it. Tis a rare drop, clearly. You wouldn't think so, because every saber cat has two of those great big tuffers poking out of their gobs. But it's like, no, didn't find any on this one. Oh, no, those? No, they're just for show. I saw a wolf, but the wolf is gone. Hmm. Oh. There he is. <sighs> Beautiful day. There we go. Oh god! <laughs> Bear cub go brrr! salmon from this. Like, oh wait, no, if I'm harvesting it, it might just give me the salmon meat. Alright, never mind. I wondered if I could put that salmon in the fish tank, even though it's clearly dead, but no. There's a thing involving the Pirate King of the Abyssian, which I have not yet done. I'm going to need to have another look into what I need to do with that, because that, that'll be a fun thing to do. And it happens at the College of Winterhold as well. I think I need to make certain gems, possibly? Or have certain gems. Who's this? Running alone through the wilderness. They might be a criminal. Where'd they go? Was it a ghost? <laughs> Did I just see a ghost? Hmm. Oh, no, never mind.
Right, skirt around the edges of Windhelm. And head north, the way I normally do. Wait, are you...? Move on, friend. I have nothing to say today. Oh, that, I mean, that makes a lot of sense, because you're here on your own. Where's the rest of the Khajiit caravan? Nice chilly water. Hey, what's that? Cod! I'll have a cod. Catch it! There we go. Couple of cods. Have you visited Rorikstead lately? No matter how harsh the winter, the crops that grow there never falter. Yes, very nice. Very cool. Very interesting. Oh, wait, no, she's my wife. I need to be nice to her. Thank you. Oh, very, very informative, Jordis. Thank you. Please tell me that fact again at some point. Oh my god, protect the fox! Eh. No. Leave it alone. Am I too late? I don't see a body. Did I manage it? Did <laughs> right in the cheek. Wonderful. Is the fox okay? Did it live? I saw the troll take a swing, but I didn't see... I think I think the fox got away. Yeah. I'll say that the fox got away. Another one. This one's chasing a goat. There we go. This time I saved the goat. Aw, wabbit. I suppose at some point I should go back up to High Hrothgar and meditate on Words of Power in case I can unlock any more. <laughs> Marriage is what brings us together. <laughs> it never gets old. Oh. He looks like a he looks like a chill dude. <laughs> Get it? Because he's because he's a frost giant. Are you baddies? No. Out with it. Nearly there. I might be able to pick up some special fish out in the sea, actually.
Ooh, excuse me. Oh, hello, mate. <laughs> now, have the bandits respawned? All good so far. Why sure is that? Excuse me. Is that a solar star? Um. Oh. Did you come to visit such a rare treasure? Why is the shop locked? Yes, we are, Jordius. Yes, we are. Okay, here we are. Bring the staff to Enthir. Enthir gives a thing to Arniel. And then we'll find out what else Arniel wants, if anything. He would have to be upstairs, wouldn't he? All right, Gov. Taking me up on my offer, eh? Good. Here's the staff you wanted. Well, well. All right. You delivered on your end, so I'll deliver on mine. Here's the gem Arniel was after. Can't imagine what he expects to do with that. It's warped beyond any ability to capture a soul. A warped soul gem. Hmm. Arniel, my man. Greetings, Archmage. I've got the soul gem. Do you? Wonderful. I was afraid I'd have to give up. And when I'm so close... Thank you for this. I have a great deal of work ahead of me. Can I speak to him again? Divines bless you. May the ground you walk quake as you pass. Wow. How is your project coming along? Terrible. Just terrible. <laughs> I vastly underestimated the heat. He hasn't had time to work on it. And have destroyed my only working model. I'm at a loss. I have no idea what you're talking about. Look, it's all very simple. The Dwemer, they were uh, masters in magic in a way we can't even begin to conceive of. It's true. Their greatest achievement, however, has also been their greatest... Shall we say, mystery? Precisely. What could be worth studying about a long lost civilization? Their disappearance, of course. Instant, unexplainable. The stories have fascinated me. Ever since I was young, I wanted to know what really happened. Same. Same. After years and years of work, I'm closing in on a way to investigate what happened through experimentation. Only now, well, it's simply a disaster. Without boring you with the uh, details, I'm attempting to recreate the circumstances of the event. Mm. The dwarves were very clever, tapping into and drawing power from the heart of Lorcan itself. Indeed. Lacking the heart of the dead god myself, I was attempting to substitute a rather specific soul gem, the uh, one you helped me acquire. Well, yes, I mean, no. That is, it might, but I'm not completely sure. I'm no tonal architect. I've only read their writings. Scraps, really. The soul gem by itself isn't enough, you see. It needs to be altered, purified. The dwarves had machines for this sort of thing. I've attempted to build my own, based on designs and using parts you helped to provide. My very own dwarven convector. It worked, but not fully. And the, uh... The device was destroyed in the process. Mwap, mwap, mwap. Hmm? No, no, no! I'm too close now. Can't take the time. Though, perhaps there's another option. I, uh, I may require further assistance from you. 
Of course you do. Well, yes. The designs for my convector were based on real dwarven machines, so there may still be some in existence. I'd go looking myself, but... Yes, there are calculations to double, triple, check. Uh, many calculations. Perhaps you could seek out these convectors in Skyrim ruins. I can even teach you the spell to heat them. It's very particular and very important. Teach me your spell and I'll see what I can do. Wonderful. Just wonderful. I knew I could count on Welcome back, Cinny. Now, this spell is not for defending yourself, but it's just right for heating the convector. At least three seconds burn is necessary. Just place the soul gem inside and heat the convector. At least three seconds. You'll almost certainly need to find multiple convectors. I suspect it may be due to the nature of the soul gem versus the crystals this was intended for. Destroys the equipment in the process. But, ah, it's effective. Three times, and the crystal should be ready for the next step. Isn't this exciting? <laughs> Teach us your ways, Daddy. Arniel gain. Daddy Arniel. Arniel's convection added. Place the warped soul gem into a convector. Now, it doesn't give us a quest um, objective for that, because they are just placed randomly in the world. I know where one of them is. And that's it. I will have to look up where the locations are for the others. The first one is where... What's her name is? When she wanted to... She wanted us to find her Dwemer... Something or other by a, by a riverside. I forget exactly where she was for that. I feel like it's somewhere over here. I think it's possibly near Deep Folk Crossing? Which is... Uh, somewhere here, I think? Serene, that's it. Serene, Serene Gerard. <laughs> um, anyway, I am going to go straight to the Dawnstar Sanctuary first. And see if I can find that missing item that artifact actually before I do that I will find out where the three best Dremor Convectors are um okay There are six convectors in all of Skyrim. Mm. Okay. Are any of these on my way? No. Nope. Shaw's Stone, which is in the rift. Mzincha left, no. Uh, Folgenthur. Oh, one says two are north of Carthwaston, which is um Carthwaston. Eh? I thought it was around here.
Oh, there's Carth Waston. All right, I'll I'll just put a marker there. Well, sorry, I'll, I'll make my way to Dawnstar, put a marker there, and then we'll see. It was west of the Druid Dark Redoubt and south of Darkfall Cave, where Serene was with the Cogs. Ah, Darkfall Cave. Okay, thank you, Siri. Actually, that might mean where. Ah, so that must be one of them. Yeah. Draw a dark redoubt. Okay. We'll see. I need, what is it, three of them. And to heat the convector for three seconds each time, so... Yeah. It's doable. But first, Dawnstar Sanctuary. Next, the Dragonborn Gallery. Then... Then I'll go to... That place. Then back into Darkfall Cave to try and get the rest of the fragments for Falma. Oh, and I'll see if I can get some ocean-going fish for the fish tanks. Hello, Brian. Did I say Dragon Ball Academy? No, sorry. Dragon Dragonborn Gallery. <laughs> Thank you, Cine. Welcome, Brian. How's it going? Uh, although Dragon Ball Academy in Skyrim, that'd be a sight to see. <laughs> Play a character, use a dragon shout to go Super Saiyan or Cyan. I don't see any fish. Oh, there is a fish. And it's salmon, which I already have. Oh, who annoyed the porker? Silly sausages. Been a while. It has, it has. I hope you're keeping well. Uh oh. Oh, leave the hawker alone. Oh, there's a, there was a floating box there. Did you see that? Yes, you'll see them burn. What was what? There's nothing there. Skyrim rule number one, do not bother the hawkers. Exactly. I've never had a hawker attack me other than for the reason that I'm getting too close. You can just leave them alone. They're fine. <gasps> Please have a saber cat tooth. No! God damn. Why are they so rare? They're rarer than hen's teeth. It's annoying because I only need one. I just have to hope that an alchemist somewhere has one. Poor things are just loafing around and people come to bother them. How dare. I know, right? You can say the same of seals and sea lions and uh, walruses. Oh, it's an orange scallop shell. All orange. <laughs> okay, how close are we to Dawnstar? Oh, not far. And the sanctuary is on the coast of Dawnstar anyway. You're salmon, aren't you? Yeah, salmon. 
you know what I miss having? Cream cheese and smoked salmon bagel from Bagel Factory. Man, that was good. With like bits of pepper in it as well. Was I in the Darkfall Cave recently? No, I went to Darkwater Crossing or Darkwater Pass, something like that. Darkfall Cave, I'm kinda heading I'm kinda heading towards. That'll be the third destination. The first is Dawnstar, second is the gallery, third will be Darkfall Cave. Oh, no, sorry, not quite. It'll be Dawnstar, gallery, then the place where Serene was. So around here, I guess. Ooh, excuse me. Then Darkfall Cave. Darkfall Cave has veil saber cats and they have teeth. Oh, okay. Thank you, Simi. Yes, I will. Perhaps I'll go through the long way then and I'll um, harvest me some tuffers. Okay. We are pretty much here. I'm going to have to do Locate Relic when I'm outside the Dawnstar Sanctuary. I'll try getting in, but I, st I don't think it's going to happen. Forgotten Vale too, but it'll be a longer journey then. Well, I need to go to the Forgotten Vale anyway, so it all checks out. Because the Forgotten Vale has the most um, Falmer dig sites there, so that'll be where I need to go to get all the fragments that I need to make the thing that I need to do for the quest that I'm doing. Words. Right. What is life's My love life. Being happily married. Ah, <laughs> oh, sad. Well, hopefully, I don't need to go inside. Oh, no. Locate the tumb tumbler bane gloves in the area around Dawnstar Sanctuary. But it says there's no artifact nearby. This is the sanctuary. I can't get inside. Uh, Fuck's sake! How did it? How did it do this? Surely it knows that I killed all all the Dark Brotherhood, so I can't get in here. Or is there another way to get in there that I don't know about? Um. Hello, Warriski. <laughs> Beautiful. I mentioned bagels. Now you want bagels? Do it. Find the bagels. Uh, I'm going to have to look up how to get around this, if I even can. Actually, maybe it'll be in the wiki for the Dragonborn Gallery. Um, Right. Yeah, the sanctuary is unlocked during the Dark Brotherhood quest to the Cure for Madness, which I can't do. Can I just make a replica? There's a hatch behind a rock near the entrance to Dawnstar, I think. Might be modded, though. Ah. Okay. Hang on, Morrisky. I've got the wiki up. Let's see.
The password is learnt by reading Cicero's journals, but I guess I don't get his journals at all because I don't think I don't think, I don't think he can be killed. Can you? That's part of the upgrades you can do when the Dark Brotherhood questline is done. Fuck's sake. Yeah, secret entrance or exit. Mm. You are unable to enter the sanctuary without reading Cicero's journal first. Okay, Cicero's journal. Can I get can I get these without activating a quest? Am I able to try unlock console command? I doubt it because it's not built like a locked door. You have to get in via a riddle. Mm. It tells me about the um, Cicero's journals, but not how to get them. What about Cicero himself? Ah. Upon his arrival at the Dark Brotherhood Sanctuary, he will settle down in the easternmost room... In his room, he will scatter all four volumes of his journals, so I can't even get to his journals. This is so fucked. It hasn't read that I've defeated the Dark Brotherhood. It just thinks that I can get into the Dawnstar Sanctuary. This is completely broken. Um, what a pain in the ass. Um, he appears later in the quest line. Yeah. Um, hang on. What if I try? Um, how to get into Dawnstar Sanctuary without joining Dark Brotherhood. Here we go. How do I gain access to Dawnstar Sanctuary if I destroy the Dark Brotherhood? What the fuck kind of comment is this? Shut up. Um... God, this guy's got to stick up his ass. Is it, should I even? Okay. Um. This was th this original post was in July 2013. Uh, how do I gain access to the Dawnstar Sanctuary if I destroyed the Dark Brotherhood? I have been trying to enter the Dawnstar Sanctuary, but I find I am unable. If you can tell me how to get it, that'd be great. Note: I destroyed the Dark Brotherhood. F uh, four years later. May 2017, this person says, TLDR, but I don't care. If you think I use too many words or syllables, you can skip my post entirely. I know this thread is very, very old. If that bothers you, you're likely under 30 or have too much OCD and is a side point. But I'm here to make a legitimate comment in response to some of the things said now quite some time ago. If you don't like what I have to say or it upsets you, that says more about you than it does about me. You might want to take some time in reflection and consider why that may be. What the fuck is this? And it goes on and on. It's like a fucking essay. This is this is reading like a Grandpa Simpson, like... Blah, 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 blah. 
Fucking hell. Uh, this person says, I killed her and still got in. There is a way you can get into the sanctuary without using console commands. The simple way is that you install this person's mod. I'm not installing a mod. Okay, you know what? This calls for drastic action. I'm going to need to teleport in there with the console command. Um, hang on. What the fuck? I know! What a fucking... Gee, I don't even know what we've responded to. We just put this entire essay... Hello, Tim. You've been working, for, uh, sorry, working, lurking for a while, but hi, aya. <laughs> You're right, Tim. How you doing? Uh, right, Dawnstar. Sanctuary. Uh, console location code Dawnstar Sanctuary. Now, I think it might be as simple as this. Let's save first. Center on cell. Oh, where am I going? Oh, oh, where am I going? Okay, if anyone asks, Valand fell into a black hole that just appeared in front of the door. No, oh, he's woken up. What's happened? Where is he? What a great mystery this is! Oh, there's a there's a there's a thing over there. Um. Oh, I hope I can get out. <laughs> uh, ooh, oh dear. I only came here for the gloves. Oh. Oh, no, here we go. So, yeah, I absolutely shouldn't be in here. This is all quest related, but... Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh. Guess I'm fighting these ghosts. So it looks like my quarry is through there. So not only do I have to teleport in here illegally, I also have to turn off collision. Um... Oh, shove off! Okay. Here we go. Wom, wom, wom. Look at this special ability I have. The ability to walk through walls. Ooh. What a special ability this is. I can only use it when I'm really concentrating, though. Ooh. Free gold. And Grigor's journal. But this is all Dark Brotherhood related. I don't want to... Yeah. Doing good, just chilling with Bren. Noise. Have you? you uh, I'll get you, you. You guys saw Guardians Three today, right? What did you think? Spoiler free, obviously. I saw it yesterday. Uh, I wonder if it has Cicero in there or not. Probably not, because at the moment he's somewhere near White Run, isn't he? And he doesn't appear in here until you do that quest. So, wait. Oh. Wait, hang on. Oh, no, it is connected. I just still can't get in. This is fucking bollocks! I'm having to just break the game just to get this fucking... 
There we go. Right. Gimme. Yay. I did it. Uh, I'm gonna... Oh no, I can't use the relic thing. I was gonna see if there are any more relics in here, because if there are... I'll... Oh. That's... Yeah, it's very cool. Um... So... So hang on, this is all... Yeah, it's just a regular wall there. Okay, I don't know how this works. Never mind. Um, how do I get out? Maybe I have to go up through the ice cave. Sorry, it'll be a, it'll be a nice secondary adventure, won't it? All right, let's boogie. You're seeing it tomorrow, seven o'clock tomorrow. Ah, gotcha. Okay. Well, I I put some thoughts in the film and TV channel, in the Robo Discord, but um, I have included uh, the spoilers are covered up, so you can see what I thought about it without spoiling yourselves if you are interested. Uh, this door is barred from the other side. Uh, all right, here we go. Um, I might be about to encounter a unique beast that I thought I would encounter on Solstheim, but nope. It's here. And we saw it earlier. And now we're going to go up close and personal with it. Hello there! It's the Udafrikt! Was the Udafrikt. Um, not really anything unique about it other than that it's a troll. But in Morrowind, the Udafrikt is a unique, like very unique, it's like a unique model and everything. And you get like a severed leg weapon from it. Okay. Mm this away. Please let me out. I don't want to be in here forever. I feel like I'm just going further into the sanctuary now. Uh oh. <laughs> Precious release. Valand learning from Croft. <laughs> Probably an upgrade to the base. The wall disappears after purchase. Oh, okay. I can't wait to see it. It was good, Tin. I really, I enjoyed it. Like, I feel like I can't really say too much because I don't want to. It's like, it's like I said about Forbidden. We uh, sorry, Horizon Zero Dawn. Sometimes even a non-spoiler can be a spoiler to a degree. This better have some good loot in it. Nailed it. Do I need the card of walls, number three? Nope, I need the ace, queen, and king of walls. Um, okay. Yeah! <laughs> no, I think I'm going the route that it would intend me to go down if I was doing the quest for it. So this this isn't the way out. Yeah, there's just... Ooh, a loot chest. Ooh, there's a torture chamber. Ooh, it's all bloody and minging. 
Aquamarine. I don't need that. Route. True that, indeed. Travises. I think I might need to get out this way, but there's no button to open these chain uh, bars unless there's a button I can press elsewhere. What's this? All oh, right, this is back here. Okay, and this was around where I teleported in. Ah, here we go. This might be the way out. Excuse me. Suddenly traps. Sorry, I'm only here for the owl. I'm only here for the gold. Oh, I think my custom quest marker is pointing towards... Ah! Yay! I made it out. <laughs> I made it out legitimately. Finally. Well, that was a bit shit in that I had to... cheat my way in there, but I had no choice. I've destroyed the Dark Brotherhood. I can't I can't get in there. And even if I, even if I hadn't joined the Dark Brotherhood, I'm not about to go and, just go and join them just to get an artifact. It would have gone against everything that Valand does. In oh, the salmon! It beached itself. Sorry, I'll save it. Oh wait. Oh, I think I. Okay, I put it out of its misery. That's different. Hello. Looking to hire a boat? I can take you to any port on the coast. Can you? Why can't I? Oh, use ferry seat. Now nah, uh, I don't know. If I'm not using a horse and cart, then I can't use a boat either. It goes against my no fast travel law. I'm trying to kill the slaughterfish. Susie, thank you so much for the raid. How was Ocarina of Time? Boop. Boop. There it is. Bless you, Lego Shark. Bless you. You beat the Water Temple finally. It took you long enough. Hey, fantastic. Yeah. I was I was tuned in. I was a lurking. Looked like good work to me. Well, GG's. I think I might have asked this last time, but do you reckon you will try the randomized version of the game when you're when you're done with it? Or do you think you would need to get more familiar with it first? Don't run away, Merlin. Come on, you're tougher than that. Okay. So, now we're going to the Dragonborn Gallery. Then I'll go to... the Dwemer Convector. Then I'll go to Darkfall Cave. There you go. There's our plan. There's our three-step plan. Every Skyrim stream, there's a three-step plan. Until those steps are done, and then it becomes a two-step plan. Plus one. Maybe in the future you definitely need to get more familiar with the game. Yeah, fair enough. Fair enough. I've never played it myself, but I think, I think I've said that before as well. Hmm. Where did you come from? I wanted to play more Hob earlier, but um. I had a nap instead. Mm -hmm. Ooh. <gasps> 
Oh, that's a shell I've not seen before. It's a conch. A striped conch. Ah, okay. Always nice when I see something different. Oh, what's this? Is this uh that's part of the tree, okay. I'm on the lookout for artifacts and unique items, you see. Oh, there's uh, a dog and a skeever having a fight over there. Are you a friendly dog? Hey! Hey, come back! Why are you fighting a fox for? Oh, dog's got... Are you a, are you a, are you a, are you a bad dog? Wait, we come back here! Hello? I can talk to you, but that's it. What are you angry for? What? Are you angry with me? Why? What's the matter, eh? What is it? Because Serana shut. Look! Look, dog. We have other dog. Maybe you can make a little Jack Russell wolfhound together. I don't know what the deal is with this dog. It's like he's angry, but he's not attacking me. Oh well. Be on your own, then. Sag. Nice. Oh, now you're following us. Oh wait, oh, do you belong to these guys? Ah, oh, there you are. Yes, we found your dog barking at me. Dog. You fucking what? Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Defeated. As you should be. She fucking had it coming. <laughs> It was like that moment with that with that prisoner that I set free. And then he said, next Imperial I see is dead. You what? <laughs> Calling a dog stupid. And she she knew what she was doing. She walked over to that dog and was like, stupid dog. <laughs> now the neighbour comes from the next village to complain about the dog. Wow. <laughs> oh, hello. There's a... Oh, a hawker has been marked by kind. What the fuck's going on now? Oh, the undead are after us. Okay. Now, can I shoot that from here? I'll try. Oh! Oh, Kain has just released it. Never mind. If that moment didn't get clipped, I will have to go back and clip it myself. I, I need to go back and find that moment last week where Valand took a Reikling spear to the face. <laughs> I raised the shield and the spear just went over it. I went, <laughs> I want to get that bit clipped. Uh, that tickled me, that did. Nordic Fragment, good. Thank you, Cine. <laughs> Valand Rampage. It was perfectly justified, and... I mean, I didn't see, but I don't think I got a bounty either, so it was justified. It wasn't a crime. Justice was served, despite it being... Wait, no. Yeah, she committed a crime of being rude to a dog. And therefore, I had a, fr a free reign to end her life. <laughs> but thank you for the clip, Cine. Again, I am slowly assembling a Skyrim clip show, which I will debut once the Skyrim playthrough is over. So, any weird or funny things that happen that you think should be clipped, please do. Um... It saves me having to try and remember them and go back to get them later. 
and it will extend the cut of the clip show as well. I think it's up to like 15 to 20 minutes now. And I mean, I'm not I'm not done yet. So obviously there's still a lot more to get to to get, but yeah. There were quite a few clips that were just nothing though. But I think that's more poor user interface. What's your beef, ghost? Not even a proper ghost. Unless that was his name. Oh, hello. You hot? Oh. You're struggling there, mate. Ah, uh, here we are. At last. Back to the gallery to drop off more shit. Clipping is on fire! <laughs> Ghost doesn't have beef. Has no meat at all. Supposedly, but... I mean... That was no ethereal presence. There was meat. There was flesh. Bone. Oh, another conch. Wait. Oh, I think I've got this one before because I couldn't pick it up. I had to get real close to it. Never mind. I have a conch. And I will put it in the aquatic display in the Hall of Natural Science along with any gems that I've picked up. Carp. Have I got a carp? Well, now I have two. More fish for the fish god. Okay, here we are. Ta -da. And while I'm here, I will go to Radiant Raymond and see if I can pick up some of those amulets. Zenithar, Stendar, Kinareth, Julianos, Dibella, Arke, and Telos. What's up? You speaking to me? Let's go, bitch. Of course I'm gonna join you. That's my fame. Please follow me. My men and the other able fighters will be gathering outside the gate. Everyone, keep yourself safe. We got a raid. <laughs> That's me trying to toot my horn. Is he? Is he on the move? Hello, friend. Hello. Come on. No time to waste. Let's go. <laughs> this guy's still, still having a drink. Tonight, we dine in hell. Where are the enemies at? Where do they come from? Ready yourself, lads and lasses. 
Got guys, gals, and non-binary pals. What's going on? Over there? <laughs> What's going on? Who would be stupid enough to raid Solitude anyway? Wait, did I hit did I hit the right person? It's really hard to make sure that I'm not Okay, you're a bandit, yes, good. Kill the leader. How do I know who the leader is? Oh, we did it, yay! Well done, whoever killed the leader. Hey, yo, my dude. Come back. God, he's in a fucking hurry. Hello. That was a good fight. The victory tastes sweetest when our enemies are as furious as Storm. You have my gratitude, Dave. Two lockpicks, Amulet of Stendar. Hey! Mud crab chitin, deadly poison, three mord, three knee, three, three nord mead. Salt pile, cooked fish, baked potatoes. Bloody hell! What a what a fucking hamper. Two hundred and forty gold, and that's it. Wow. I mean the, the amulet. Yeah, I'll take that. Um, and then hopefully I can get some more from the shop. Ah, look at that. Beautiful. There was somewhere in the UK recently where you could see the Northern Lights and it wasn't even that far north. I forget where it was though. I can't, I can't think where it was. I'm sure I saw it in the headlines. And there was like videos as well. Hmm. Right. It is the middle of the night, so I'm going to wait seven hours. Silly, you went through the clips, still laughing at the Debella statue falling over the guy. And the hot tub one. Oh, yeah. Wait until you see what I've done with the hot tub one. I've made it... I think I've made it funnier, but, I, you know, I don't know. I can't really say my own work is funny when it's me watching it. It took it took a bit of time to do as well, but yeah. Come in and shut the door. All right. Right. Oh, what delight! Another charming customer. Let's see if we can't find an outfit that suits you. I require an amulet of Talos. Done. Uh, then. Is that it? That's it. It's the only amulet I could get. Never mind. Rude. Very rude. Northern Lights, it was this teacher making something called Steam Hams. <laughs> Aurora Borealis. R.K. Debella, Julianos, Kinnereth, Zenithar. Maybe I can get some from the Temple of the Divines. Let me head over there and see. I've got a little work if you're interested. It is over here, isn't it? Why sure is that? Is that a solar storm? Hmm. Event. Ah. Yeah, I know what this is for. I've never done it, but I know what it's for. Right. Ah, hello. You look troubled. Have you come seeking guidance? Mm, never mind. The strong and honourable always carry the blessing of the eighth. Feel free to take a seat or pray at the shrines. 
We appreciate worship in all its forms. Well, I suppose you've got just some amulets just lying around, do you? That I can just have? You know, maybe? I have just remembered that I was going to check the gallery in case they are... In case, I've, in case I've stored any spares away. Being old's not so bad. Daughter keeps me fed. My working days are done. Why is there an enchanted chest? Order of the Nine Divines. Oh god, what's this going to do? I don't want to do it in case it takes something away from my infantry. I'll save first. May knowledge of... The valor, the valor and courage of Pelinal White Strike is nothing short of legendary, and his legacy lives on in the relics of the Eight Divines. Oh, of course, the Knights of the Nine stuff. Divinity carry us through our daily so th yeah, that must have been when I got one of the artifacts. As High Priest of the Eight Divines, we welcome you to worship the Eight Divines freely and openly. Notice how he's saying Eight Divines, as if Talos means nothing to him. Uh. Okay, this is where they sleep. And this is... Oh, I can get in, okay. Uh, oh. What do you think you're doing? Sorry, sorry, sorry. Uh, oh god. Let me just put that down. Uh, just the one. There you go, see, I'll put it back. I'm no longer stealing. Potamus Catacombs, oh, okay. Stop, in the name of the yard. Oh, I'm sorry! Stop right there, criminal scum! What happens here, darling? I fear attendance is down. There are so few worshippers coming to see us. Could it be that the war... By order of the yard, stop right there. I'm the... I'm the Jarl's Thane. I demand you let me go at once. Oh, forgive me, Thane. I didn't realise it was you. We <laughs> looked the other way this time. But even the Jarl is influenced at the limit. Be more careful. I picked it up by accident, you fool. Although you probably wouldn't know that. And of course, it would sound like an excuse. Okay, there are no ambulances here. Didn't have enough outsiders. Now we've got mercy. Blessings of the eight divines upon you. There you go. See, all is forgiven. I put the potion back. I've apologised. All is well. Okay. I hear the East Empire Company has reopened. Thanks in no small part to you. Well done. Didn't I didn't hear half of what she was saying because the kids started talking, but they went what what pass. Okay, in we go. There's a lot to load in, so I appreciate it takes a while. There we go. Okay, I think the gloves will be going up here. Uh, over here. Tumbler Bane gloves. There we go. Right. Hmm. Okay. There, there is one of each, but they're not duplicates. They're the ones that are actually on display. So if I took them, I would then have to find more to display them, which sucks. Um. Okay. Yeah, one of those I need for the for the for the infinite shout. Ooh, the warlock's ring. Can I display that? It does look unique. Whoops. Oh, I didn't mean to take that.
Thank you for the lurk, Nick. Appreciate you. I hope you're keeping well. Uh, okay, what we got here? Can I display this now? Yes. And then the Warlock's Ring. Is it going to display those? Yep. There they are. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Look, I've still got so many rings to get. I mean... Jeez Louise. You have a jagged crown I need to make a replica of. And the major circlet. Actually, Serana. Do you need something? Anything good? Well, I'm going to be letting you go soon anyway, so... Ooh, value, 1,069. Nice. Lead on. There you go. Cheers, love. Um, thank you for your contribution to the museum. <laughs> uh, right, I think everything I have to display is... In is elsewhere, so let me just run around, head over there. I'll go to the archaeology table and I can find out what I need to make the Trinimac artifact. Here we are. Mm. That's it, the Shrine of Ifri. Requires 50 Falma fragments and I have 31. And I've got enough keystones for it. That's really good to know. God. I need so many stuff. So many things. Oh, you can make Dwemer fragments. Oh, that's cool. Oh, I've got the Dwemer cogs as well. I could have made some. Oh, well. Oh, these are cool. A Dwemer royal bust. Uh, right, I'm not making these because I need them. Alright, never mind. Um, bu -bu -bu -bu. Read the barber. Oh, hello. No, this is just this is just useless stuff. Okay. No. Um okay. Need something. Um Okay, let me go in here first. I don't know if that Debella statue will be able to be spawned in here. Because... I don't know, there's a, there's, there's a display pay, place for the Debella statues, but... I feel like it's only going to work with ones that appear in the vanilla game. I don't know if it would have one that's um, modded. We shall see. In here. Oh no, there you go, there's another one. And that's it. One more, apparently, will go there. Ornate statue of Debella. That's a lot of Debella statues. Dragging Nord for me. <laughs> um, I think I have. I think I've picked up a coin. Uh, is it going to display one? Oh, I didn't see. Has it? Has it changed? I hope so. Yeah, travelers and demons are the decks that I've got completed. Okay. And there's only two, three, four jade artifacts left to get. 
two jade dragons and a jade warrior. Hmm. Very good. I've got nothing for these, so I will leave and go to the natural science bit now. Need to hang out paintings as well. Ah, oh, damn, there's somewhere else I could have checked for spare amulets. I'll do it on the way out. Okay. Uh, oh, I might already have a conch then. Let's see if anything changes. Oh, yeah, there you go, there's another one. Oh, and, uh, oh, wow, look at that. Three displays. Very nice. And then see if the gems change. Yep, one over on the right, at least. Oh, five new ones. I must have nearly completed all of this as well. This side looks complete. Maybe there's room there for a couple more. And that one, definitely there. That's a lot of gems. I'm quite, I'm quite pleased with that. Look with your eyes, not with your hands, Henry. Yeah, Henry, you fucking shit. Sheesh, that looks heavy. Damn right it's fucking heavy. Just... Horrid Henry. <laughs> oh dear. Um I got to put up a bag thing. Oh. Uh Ah. Ah. Oh. What is this of? What is this? Is that that's a bird, isn't it? What is it doing? It's like it's like landing head first on a table. This is what you do at uh, uh, this is what you do at an art gallery, isn't it? You just kind of stare at it, being like, "What does this mean? What is this? What was the painter thinking when they did it?" It's like they just wanted to paint something, mate. It doesn't have to mean anything. Um, okay. Uh, to the... No, not quite the safe house. There's one more place I want to check for amulets. No, there's a spare there's a spare amulet of Talos, but that's it. And that's the one I've already got. Oh wait. Could there be fragments in here? No. Doesn't say Hang on, name. Fragment. No. Never mind. Oh, wait. Would this not go in the Hall of Natural Science? I guess it wouldn't, because it would, um... I don't think it's going to display anything. Oh, I need to go to the library and get the next relic quest. I shall go and do that. Yeah. 732 displays. Wow. And it's still not 100% complete. Mm -hmm. Right, here we go. Oh my, that's beautiful. Thank you. Relic. What's it going to be? I swear to God, if it's something else I have to get from elsewhere. I've had to go back there like four times. Look, 
Locate the Honingbrew decanter in Honingbrew Meadery. Oh, okay. Questions. Yes, sir. That will mean going to the rift for that, but that's fine. I take my leave. Actually, I might have any more. I might. I'll, I'll see if I've got any more archaeology perks to get. I only have one perk. Oh, where's where's our wonderful raccoon? Hey, yeah. Fafnir. Rocket raccoon. I think Eggleman is meant to be here, but he's not spawning correctly. Take Kamal's map. Hmm. Right, out we go. Oh, of course, my potions. These are all mine. I need all these. I still haven't. I still haven't used the blacksmith stuff. I think I might do. I might use the last of my blacksmith potions when I go to fight Alduin, because then I can just just increase everything I've got as high as it can go, and then I'll be tooled up to have that final battle. Um, yeah. Yeah. Because I'm doing okay. I don't need to improve my gear any for, anymore at this point. Right. Now, I need to go and find a Dwemer Convector. So, uh, let me go back to that tab. I've closed it because I'm an idiot. Oh, no, I haven't. Never mind. Across the river from Druadark Redoubt. So, yeah, okay, there. Oh, and there's one at Deep Folk Crossing. Both of these two. These two. So, yeah. I'll get those two, then go to the Darkfall Cave. And then, we only need to use one more. Whee! Stormcloak camps will likely be good places to get the... Amulet of the Divines from, because they worship them. Get rid of Stormcloak Rebels. Get the amulets. Killing two birds with one stone there. I still can't believe it. Married to the Dragon Baron. Never would have guessed it. <laughs> Ooh, it should be time for a beer soon. This month's theme is Siren Brewery. Talk to Gaiman if you want a horse. Or Catla, if you're looking for work. I can't help you. Okay. Because um, Siren Brewery is ten years old this year. And they're pretty good. So I'm looking forward to seeing what they've got in this. Especially, Actually, that might explain why there are ten beers. Because it's like, ah, it's our birthday. Have two on the house.
Oh, that's good. If we go to the rift to Honingbrew Meadery, we can go to Shaw's Stone. Because that's where another convector is. Oh, I'm thinking of the... Oh, I'm, I was thinking of Honeyside. No, not even that. I was thinking of... I was thinking of Golden Glow. Oops. Shaw's Stone is... There. It's fine. We'll do that. Then that. Then up to Arniel Gain. And that'll be it. Right, here we go. Stormcloak camp. Are there Stormcloaks within? Yes, there are. Hello! He's not carrying an amulet. Oh, I killed like three in one go there. Oh, come on. Why come you not wearing any? Oh, the horse died. Well, I'll drink some ale. Is that it? Oh, I guess we got them all. Hmm. Oh, you might be carrying one, but you're a zombie. I can't loot you yet. Hmm. Oh. R.I.P. horse. Right. Time for a beer. Ow, my back. Oh, okay, it's not the Siren Brewery, but it's from Siren. Siren Craft Brew from the Burnt Mill Brewery, Buried Shadow, Black IPA. Let's see what this is all about. Hmm. Cheers. Ooh. It smells quite fruity. Um... Okay. Hmm. It tastes nice, but the taste doesn't linger. It's not there for very long. If you don't really get a chance to set to to save it, head brewers Sophie and Sean have history with black IPA, so this one is everything they like best about this style. Expect a mind-bendingly dark pour and subtle roasty notes. Yeah, yeah. Offset with an outburst of citrus berry and tropical hop flavours. Yeah, I said it was fruity. Mm. Made especially to celebrate Siren's 10th anniversary. Okay. Mm. Yeah, it's nice. Not bad. Not bad at all. Oh dear. And now I've angered the fish. You what? Me? 
Oh, are you talking to the... Was she talking to the fish? You ordering the fish to halt? Sure. Well done, I guess. Halt! <laughs> you fish are swimming without a license. <laughs> oh wow, triple kill. Must have been a weak troll. Oh, hello. The fish. I am a, I am a thane of the Yarl. Don't you know who I am? Oh, apologies, my fish. <laughs> Hello, pagan. You have another Elder Scrolls joke. What do Argonian children study in school? History. <laughs> That is very Elder Scrolls. Oh, wow. <laughs> GG's. Hello, Pagan. Very good one. Uh, welcome back, Eddie. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> it's the tree. Oh. Only Elder Scrolls fans will get this. <laughs> oh. How's it going, everyone? Eddie... Pagan, how you guys both doing? What are your weekend plans? Uh-oh, there's a dragon. Is it going to come and fight us? Who knows? Yeah, I'm glad to. I'm not bad, thank you. I've had a nice day. Business as usual. Watching a movie this morning. Groceries. And then a nap. And then this. So, happy day. Right. The Dwemer Convector is just up here. And that is one of two. So this is the one across the water from Druid Dark Redoubt. Here we are. So, I need to give it the warped soul gem. Then use uh, Arniel's magic spell. Arniel's convection. And heat it for three seconds. Okay. Now I've got to go find another convector, which is across the road from Deep Folk Crossing. Across the river, rather. And that'll be two of three. I think, did I put the marker over there? No, here we go. Put it there. You like the one you told last week about the necromancy? Yeah. New Edge Mustang, it's the Almighty Robo. It's the Almighty New Edge. How are you doing? Why is the dog angry? We defended your kind earlier. Cine clipped it. Cine, if you've got the clip handy, you can post it into chat again and let these guys see. Um, I won't reveal the contents of the 
clip, but it did involve a dog. A, a good thing happened. Good things happened. It wasn't horrible. But now we've got a dog angry with us. Woof, woof. Yeah. What are those? Nom, nom, nom. New Age is doing well. You're getting ready to go out for lunch. And then try not to hurt yourself. Trying to pole vault for the first time in five years. Oh my god. I wouldn't even consider trying to do that. But then I'm not exactly built for it. But good luck to you all the same. I hope you're going somewhere nice for lunch as well. Just make sure that all the pole vaulting doesn't make your lunch come back. If you know what I mean. <laughs> Can I loot you before you go away? Thank you. Oh. oh. You won't get away. Oh, are we fighting the bear now. Oh, these bears were after the salmon, the way bears do IRL. How did that bear not take a hit? There we go. There we go. Mm, let me out! There we go. That's it. Thank you, Space. The Valand Rampage from earlier. <laughs> uh, there's a new burger joint that opened up with good food. Mm, burgies. I haven't had burger and chips for ages. Burger and fries, if you will. With, like, a delicious side, like onion rings. Ooh. Oof. I mustn't. I can't budget for it. And it's naughty. I'll be gaining weight that I've lost. Right. This is Deep Folk Crossing. So there's meant to be... Oh, I think the, I think the Convector must be on either side of this actual bridge. Let us see. Hmm. Dumber stuff. He helped out yesterday at a track meet, and he really wanted to try it again. Oh, I see, for the pole vault. Ah. Nice. Well, yeah, mind how you go. But I bet it's going to be fun. Come on, where is it? What did it say? I know. I, I always, I always, I'm always saying that, Pagan. Good food. Food that is yummy is bad for you. Food that tastes horrible is good for you. Well... Not always horrible. I think healthy food does taste alright, but it's just, it's just boring, isn't it? I've said this before. If I if you could get like strips of butternut squash or something that felt and tasted like bacon, and but had all the healthy qualities of butternut squash, that'd be amazing. It'd be so good if they did that. I did like the sound of your bacon wrapped carrots space. They sounded that sounded like a really good snack, almost like pigs in blankets but without the sausage. Your personal record in high school was 10 foot 6 inch. Damn. That is high. Tin's off to watch Star Wars The Last Jedi. We'll hopefully be back before you come off tonight. Much love. Alright Tin, no worries. And enjoy the film. FYI. The Last Jedi. In my opinion. Is the best in the, in the sequel trilogy. And I think it's an excellent Star Wars film. And that is all I will say on the matter. Across the bridge from it at an unmarked ruin just north of the map marker. So just north of this place. Okay. Oh yeah, there. Excuse me. You watched the guy vault 14 feet yesterday. Bloody hell. That's like transformer height. Yes, Eddie, you will stay calm. I am allowed to have my opinions, the same as other people are allowed to have theirs. Right. <laughs> so much stuff! There we go, warped soul gem. Then... Heat 
the Convector. There we go. One more to go. And it'll be the one that we find a uh, Shaw's Stone, I think. Because, for now... We are going... Here. Um, off to eat unhealthy but good food. Alright, New Edge, enjoy. And again, good luck with the pole vaulting. Let us know how it goes. Why is Discord removing discriminators? Is that the hash number thing? Yeah, I saw they were doing that. What 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 is what is that going to do to people who have otherwise the same username? Like, are they going to be told your unit your username clashes with this person? But one of them gets to keep it, right? I don't really get it. I think I'm not sure. I think I I'm just am I Robo Prime or am I Robo Prime Games? I went with Robo Prime Games because Robo Prime on its own was often taken. I hear Dragon. Oh, there he is. Is it going to come get us? If it comes in for the kill, we fight. If not, I'm going to go straight into the cave. Yep, yeah, here we go. Boom. Ah! Ah! It squished me! Well, I'm going to bite at your ankles now. Yep, there it is. Griffin Zoomies in Discord. Thank you, Cine. I'll check it out later. Hang on. let me. I'm going to turn and get a good look at the dragon. Or just... Oh, there you go. I'll put it like that. MP10 Optimus Prime. Okay. Not bad. Usernames are now going to be unique and only lowercase with some special characters, but we will have a display name. Ah, oh, okay. Oh dear. So here is the tired, tired old MP10 Optimus Prime. Move me out of the way as well. There we are. Boom. I think I'm gonna try and. There we go. It's a bit better, isn't it? Right. The dragon doesn't seem to be that bothered with me now. air thing that you can use to clean awkward finickety objects. Okay. There we have MP10 Masterpiece Optimus Prime. Jazz next to him. Boom. And there's me on the horse cart playing the accordion. Quote 2059. Why aren't we all grinding? Because it's rude to grind without permission. <laughs> Indeed. Ah, oh, sunset overdrive. What a game.
They, they still haven't killed the dragon yet. Oh my god. Oh wow, they've done like nothing to it. These guys are useless. Come on. Where's he going? Uh, I'm going to have to use Dragon Rend, aren't I? Oh. I believe we are staring at the inside leg of Jordis. <laughs> oh. Get over here. Missed. Got him. Oh no, don't land over there. Oh, for God's sake. <laughs> Slackers. Quote 176. <laughs> in, in Dalek voice. Oh no, here we go. Where is the doctor? Up my ass. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like you should stretch out the... <clears throat> Hang on. Where is the doctor? Up my ass. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I should have put a filter on. You're not doing much damage to me, are you? Little help, please, guys. August 2021. Bloody hell. What was I doing in Minecraft in August 2021? Was that, I think that would have been the Robocraft era. I think there was a stream where I just went off exploring. Maybe it was then. This is one tough motherfucker. Nearly got him. Got him on the ropes. There we go. Oh, now you all turn up. Fucking assholes. Right, give me the soul and I'll be on my way. Oh. Yeah, it's, it's only cool when Jordi says it. Mm. My wife! Come, Jordi. Come and explore Darkfall Cave with me. Susie, you have returned with dinner. Ah, uh, you just missed a dragon battle. What have you got for dinner? Right, here we go. Darkfall Cave. Uh, oh, there's Millie. Millie's keen. Wants to get in there straight away. All right, come on in. So I'm going to go the long way around this time because, um, as Cinny said, there is a bigger likelihood of finding a saber to saber cat tooth in here. So it means I will be taking the plunge down that cave. Where is it? Is it the one? Yeah, this is it. <laughs> Robo run. Ah! <laughs> yeah, this is the place where... Oh, hang on. Can I get over to that place over there? This bit was clipped. I knew the bridge was going to collapse, but I was just like, Oh, it looks like there's nothing wrong here. Nothing can possibly go wrong. And I fell down. What? Not us. Yeah, there you go. Dig. Dig, 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 
dig. I dug. Right. Whee! Oh yeah, this bit was in the clip as well. Because uh, we had... Oh, Merlin! <laughs> oh, I should have I got a better angle at that. Whoa, there's a spider! Ah! Oh, wrong, wrong shout. Yeah, the first time I came down here, it was with um, Potato, the husky, who um, was just animated normally and was just gliding through the water. It was very, very silly, very ridiculous. Oh, that's cool. Look at how the lighting goes down that tunnel. Come on, Merlin. I guess everybody else didn't take the plunge like I did. Because they are weak. They know not the joys of plummeting to your certain death, only to survive at the bottom. This is where a trap would have been. Oh, wait. Oh, okay, that didn't actually... Fine. I think it's this way, then. Oh, fuck! Ow! My body is broken. Um... This way. Where's everyone else, Merlin? Did you eat them? Right, well, I hope you didn't eat Jordis. You can eat the others, but not Jordis. Ooh, something over there has been marked by Kine. Troll. Yoo-hoo! Trolley, trolley, trolley! Yes, Kine is pleased. What are we getting here? Brazilianite? Oh. Okay, I guess I misremembered. I thought there was going to be... Oh, no, I know. I have to go into here bit into Darkfall Passage. That was it. And then we go through Darkfall Passage to get out into the Forgotten Vale. That was it. All of this just for a fucking saber cat tooth. But at least I'll be able to tick it off my list. And then, apart from the amulets, Lakeview Manor will be... will be completed. And that means I can... Adopt some children! And then send Jordis to live there and look after them. Man. Hello. <laughs> what a kill! That was very nicely done. Yeah, 
It was stood in just the right place. Whoops. Didn't want that, but too late. Ooh, can I dig it this one again? Ow. Oh shit. I'm looking for Falmer fragments on their bodies. been poisoned apparently. Ow. Right, let me see if I can dig at this um at this place again. Oh my god I can! Nice. So I guess, like ore veins, they do replenish um, stuff over time. 90! And I think I must be at 36 fragments now, out of 50. Jahaki delight and a painting. That means I shouldn't have to dig very many more at all. Uh-oh. Ow! Oh god. Um Oh wait. Oh yeah, this way.
Oh, hello. Do you have a tooth? Yes, you do. Yay. Thank you for the tip, Cinny. I have the saber cat teeth. Now, literally, all that's left is to get the remaining five amulets. And then I can then then Lakeview Manor will be 100% built. Right, now I just have to make my way through the cave as normal. Ah. Wow. That's impressive. Hmm. Hi. Mega kill. Here we are. All right, Gav. Um, I don't think it, I don't think it matters which one we go to. So there should be. L Whoa! Okay. Suddenly, <laughs> a dragon skeleton. Um, there should be many Falmer dig sites around here. Um, it's just a matter of finding them now. So let's just wander around. I need... what was it? Oh! I only need eight more. <gasps> nice. That means at least two dig sites. I can't imagine that'll be too difficult, but we'll see. I feel like there's one here. Welcome back, Vicky. You just had a nap. Ah, oh, that's good. I hope it was a good nap. Indeed, how can any nap be bad? The nap I had earlier today was very good. I only, I only know that because when I woke up, it was as if I'd been awake, uh, asleep for like three hours. <laughs> I was fully into it. Uh, I could swear there was a dig site on this side of the lake. Um, maybe it's over here. You had a weird dream? Ah, oh, that's no good. Well, better to have a weird dream than a bad dream, though, eh? Ah, there's a dig site. Good. Ha ha. One of two. Okay. Diggy diggy hole. Please. Wait. Oh no, can I not, can I not dig it? Maybe it hasn't replenished yet. Oh, that's annoying. Alright, never mind. Let's try and find another one. Shit. So close. So close to getting what I need. I'm hoping that I can just find the dig sites 
just out in the wild. Otherwise, I'll have to look up the interiors that they might be at. I think at least one site requires one of the paragons to find. But all the paragons are at the gallery. And I'm not going all the way back there. Just yet. Um. No. Ah, there's another one. Let's see if I can dig this one out. Yes, I can. Good. Oh wow, really? What a, what a meta dream. Meeting Star Wars characters and then showing them the movies they're in. That must have blown their minds. <laughs> oh, hello. <laughs> wow. What if, what if in showing Anakin that he becomes Darth Vader, maybe he'll change his ways and in this dream world, he doesn't become Darth Vader and he brings balance to the Force the correct way? Can I dig at this one? Yes, I can! This is it! I've got everything I need now to go back and finish the Trinimac stuff. There we go. Uh, no, this one. Although I do want that active as well. So now I have to go all the way over there. Wait, can I get there quicker from using this? In your dream, you got a massive hug from Chewbacca. Ah, that's lovely. I, I'm pretty sure Wookiees do give great hugs. Right. Um. Let's go to this one. Ah, it wants me to go here. Yeah, to the temple balcony. Okay. No more beer. Wait, now it wants me to go here. Wait, make your mind up. Where am I going? Here. If I could meet and become best friends with any fictional character, who would it be and why? Uh, that's a good one. Um, wait, it wants me to. Oh, it. Oh, it's not following the right quest. That's why I couldn't get out. Get in. Uh, oh god, who? Oh, Thor. Just maybe, maybe MCU Thor. Like. He seems like a like a great person to become pals with. He's powerful, he's fun, he knows where all the, all the good parties are. You can use the Bifrost to whisk you off into these amazing places. Yeah, Thor. And I'm a I'm a big admirer of Norse mythology as well, so There we go. Can I not Oh, I think I found this out last time. I couldn't um I can't actually leave this way. I can only travel via these portals. Are you just living here now? What a boring existence. No offence. Shrine of Resolution. This means I need to try and remember off the top of my head where to go to get to um, the uh, the thingy bob 
think it's over there. Or is it... Yeah, because you sort of go up and around, don't you? You have to enter that cave that's behind a waterfall, don't you? For you it would be Chewbacca, he would be so protective. Oh, he absolutely would, yeah, yeah. Someone so much as looks at you the wrong way. <laughs> Pull their arms off. I hope I'm going the right way. I think I am, you know. Uh, I've already got cod. Yeah, I think this is it. Not this one, but further up. I feel like Thor would be an excellent wingman as well. Yes. This has got to be it, right? Oh my god, fish! You're not meant to do that, fish. But, oh. I think I did go the wrong, like, the wrong way then. Oh no, maybe I've got to go up. Yes, this is the one. I can't believe I found this again so easily. In your dream, it was after episode 6, but Anakin had survived and become good again. And Padme had somehow come back to life. Oh, okay. <laughs> God, how pissed off would Anakin be if it came to light that Padme was actually alive? <laughs> Surprise! Another fragment, may as well. To be rude not to. Okay. Let's get to it. I need to get up to the temple entrance. Craft the shrine to Yifra, and then we'll go from there. Sitting there with Obi Wan, Anakin, Padme, Luke, Leia, Han, and Chewie. What a party! <laughs> what about R two D two? Come on, come on! Don't don't exclude the droids. <laughs> mm. I mean, C three PO. Mm. Yeah, you can, you can leave, leave him out. He doesn't need to be there. God, I wish that Skyrim had levitate, because then I could just fly up there and enter the temple. But nope. I have to go the long way around. Oh, hello. We got a bogey. R2-D2 was there as well. Good. <laughs> wow! I can't, I can't do his little, his little squeal. We have a sound alert for it, though. Oh, bye! Here's a question about Star Wars. Oh, okay. Dun 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 dun. 
suspense builds. Which ship would I have? For practical, I mean, I know, I'll let you ask the, ask, ask the question first. I don't want to get, don't want to jump again. A lot of people probably already know the Star Wars ships that I would have. But we'll see. Okay, nearly there. There's our destination. They wiped C3PO's memory, but they didn't wipe R2-D2's memory, so why didn't he recognise everyone in Episode 4? See, the person I can think of who might be able to answer that is um, my mod, Ethereal Battle, but they're not here, so I can't ask them. I mean, it could be that they did wipe a little bit of R2-D2's memory, maybe? Um, or there was a mutual understanding between Obi-Wan and R2? Or um, Obi-Wan used the Force to... Um, no, I don't think so. There we go. Fixed it. Nearly. There we go, now I fixed it. Okay. This is what I need. Shrine of Ephra. Play the final sequence found on the bottom of the shrine. Okay. In we go. There might be a lore accurate answer, but I, I am not the one to possess it. You thought they wiped both of the joy's memories. Maybe they did. I, um... It was at the end of episode three, wasn't it? I forget exactly what he says. I mean, it could be that he said, wipe these droids' memory units, but only C-3PO reacted. So, can I... How do I do this? Uh, play the final sequence found on the bottom of the shrine. Is this the one? Oh wait, I've got to put, have I got to put the shrine down? Oh dear. Um I'm going to need to look up the quest again to find out what I need to do with the shrine. Yes. A yes. I've reassembled a rendition of the Shrine of Ifra, which has etched tally marks in the base, which indicate the final sequence. 756132. Okay. Reset chimes. Then. 7, 5. So. 7. 5. Six one three. Ah, my friend. Uh, was it three two? Three. <laughs> oh, excuse me. 
I wonder if this will be another recognisable tune like it was last time. Dun, 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 dun. In episode three, he says, wipe the protocol, Joy's memory. Hmm. I wonder. Oh, you're here. It, I, I'd have to do some further reading. Okay, activate touchstone. That's it. You've done it. Fantastic. I didn't recognise that. This can't be good. You what? There you are. Don't scare me like that. Kyra said that, but where is he? This can't be good. Oh. Killed Tulrin Deathweaver. Excuse me. Oh god, he, he's claimed the Neb Crescent. Why is all the noise happening? On the chime platform, look, the ghost. Oh my god, it's the same ghost who was summoning me before that started this whole thing. I'm coming! Right. So hit the chimes and then attack him. Where even is he? Kill Tolrin. Oh, this is him. Hello, Chaotic. Nice, uh, nice battle music there. <laughs> Come on, blast the thing. Come on, lady. Right, there we go. Yeah. Oh god, I hit someone else. Oh god, I hit someone else. Ah. Honk. The goose also summons me. Oh no. I've been goosed! Yeah, follow me and then... Then when the chime is hit, I can attack you right away. Have I got something more powerful? Um, I wonder what geomagnetism would do to him. I don't think it's doing anything, but when he's vulnerable, maybe. Oh my god, yes! <laughs> right, good. Now, I'm going to use the crossbow. And take pot shots. Oh, is he impervious again now? Okay. <laughs> Whee! Look at his leg! Happy revenge of the sixth. And to you! Right, he's vulnerable. Good. Oh, 
Oh, I fucking hit Madras. This is such an awkward battle. Everyone's getting in the way. Thank God they don't go hostile. Right, this, no, this isn't working. Uh, what else can I try? More is agony. Blech. Um. Well, why don't I go with the old classic fire breath again? He's almost dead. There we go. Finally. Gimme. Ah, uh, the Blade of Treachery. That's a pretty beasty looking blade. Look at that. Uh, that was it. Yes, it was. But we managed to pull through in the end. Indeed. Now you're fine. Well, you managed to pull through in the end. We all did. Better to pull through than pull out. The rest of you, but I'm anxious to get back home. Despite all that we've uncovered, that still needs study. All this excitement in combat has me quite weary. All right, Vicky, no worries. Enjoy. Same here. I certainly have a few wounds are going to take some time to mend. That's for sure. Mm. Well, you had best take care of the Ned Crescent Guild, Master. Lock it away in the Daedric Gallery. Yes, indeed. I have a fitting spot all ready for it in the museum. Locked away with the rest of its baleful brothers and sisters. Yeah, I need to speak well, to you about that. I suppose we should get to packing up. Before we do, however, I'd like you all to join me in a toast. Firstly, to Professor Patero Morasa. Oh yeah, he friend, died, didn't he? Mentor and colleague. You Jeez. will be sorely missed, my friend. But I'd like to dedicate this victory to your memory. Yes, to Morasa. Oh, you, you guys all have drinks? Hang on. Have I got a drink? Uh oh yeah, I've got some mead. Drink. And I'm gonna eat my baked potatoes with it. To our guild master, without whom we would have never had many of the great opportunities we've had to explore the world of Skyrim. Ah, oh, you guys. To the guild master. No, you. Here's to you. No, you. Well, my friend, you have accomplished something truly great here today. Beyond our discoveries, which are numerous, we have also protected Skyrim from a terrible fate. I will send messages to the Jarls to inform them what has transpired here today. Just in case any remaining cells of Tulrin's clan decide to move forward with his plans. Mm. As for you, my friend, you should probably gather the artifacts we utilized in this excavation and return them to the museum. I'll see you back there in a day or two. And again, thank you. Serana, come on. Can I speak to you about... No. Until next time. Right, we'll have to wait until he's back at the gallery before I can talk to him about Deepholm. But that's it! That was the final excavation quest for the um, Explorers Guild. And I think the last major thing you do for the Dragonborn Gallery. Sag. Yeah, that's just where the Neb Crescent was. <sighs> well, let me pick up the staves first. If I can find where they are. Uh, nothing in there. That's closed. Um. I don't think I can display the chimes anywhere. Oh, here we go. One. Oh, the other one must be outside over here. Uh, 
Yeah, here we go. Ah, oh, the end of an era. But there are still more things to do. <laughs> you what? <laughs> What's that supposed to mean? Um. Oh, they've they've just injured themselves. Nice to see you. To see you. Nice. Wait a minute. Oh, I see. God, it's going to take ages to get all of these. You have to go to all these dig sites. Yeah, that might have to be something else that I skip over. Just don't have the time to go and do that. That'd be really boring. City's going to bench. Have a lovely evening, everyone. Ah, all right, Cini. Good night to you. Sleep well. Looking forward to seeing the Griffin zoomies later. Ah, <laughs> oh, little speed demon. Oh yeah, there's a shortcut, isn't there? Out into the Forgotten Vale. Oh yeah, I forgot it was here. Well... Time to make our way back to Skyrim. Oh. Kinda sad that another... Another big quest line has come to an end. Then again, the mod might still surprise me with other things. I don't know. I've never played it before, so we'll see. But I, I, I do think that's the end of it. It's a pretty big, significant event, wasn't it? Where the fuck am I going? Noit, noit. Noit, noit. <laughs> Um, this is where I came out, isn't it? Yeah. Um, this way? Uh-oh. Oh, hello. There's a, a thing. Oh, I think the quest marker is wanting me to go to the temple balcony, but I can't get there. Um, possibly. Or am I just being a dumbass? Oh, here we go. This is it. The way through. Yeah, then down here. Oh. Leg of goat. Oh, well, the Explorer's Guild has come to an end, and soon Lakeview Manor will come to an end as well, so... Two significant endings. Hang on, no, I think I need to go this way. 
Wait, do I? Oh god, I'm, I'm all turned around. Why can't it just be a direct route? Oh well, just let me see if clairvoyance works. Oh yeah, I'm going this way. Good. Oh god, and I said once the latest Explorer's Guild excavation was done, I would send Serana home. Oh man. When I go to Shaw's Stone, because that's in the rift, I will um, bid her farewell. Oh, Serana. After so many years! Uh, wait. Seventh of Second Seed. When's Valen's wedding anniversary? 10th of Morningstar. Okay. Oh, I didn't put the fake cards in with the other packs. Oh, well. Here we are. Of course, yeah. I'll be saying goodbye to Jordis and Serana today. Oh man! <laughs> I mean, there's still just under two hours to go. It might not be that way, but we'll see. Depends what else I get done. Uh, right, this way. Or do I stick with it and get the rest of the artifacts? What I could do to save a lot of time is draw up a list of the artifacts that I need, then go on the Legacy of the Dragonborn wiki to find out where they all are, and then just go and get them all rather than having to do the relic quest each time. I find it annoying that I can't have more than one quest active at one time. I have to go to the library, get the relic quest, go and get the relic, come back, then do another one. I think it would be nice to just go on like a, like an artifact run. Just like, whoops, find out where all the artifacts are, or at least the ones that I care about, and then just grab them. So, I might look into that later. We'll see. Where are all these quest markers? So hang on. I've got... Get the decanter. Then... Oh, place the warped soul gem into a final convector. Oh, have I had quest markers for that this whole time? Oh, what the hell? Ah, oh, okay. Fine. And then we'll go to Arniel Gain. Right. Before I do that, I do just want to pop over here to see if I can fix the music that keeps looping. Then we'll go to Lakeview Manor and finish that off. Actually, you know what I just thought? I wonder if I can craft the amulets that I need. I might do, you know. I think that's a possibility. And that would be really handy if I could. I'll look into it when I find a uh, anvil, maybe. Uh oh. Oh. Only a fool lets himself get surrounded. Man. It's just occurred to me how close I am to finishing what I want to do in Skyrim. I think I think I genuinely am, because like 
Did you hear something? Lakeview Manor is almost done. If I can find, if I if I can craft the amulets, then that will be a big shortcut, and I could maybe dedicate just a couple of streams for that. Then it's I'll f finishing off what I need to do with annual gain. I still need to adopt children, don't I? Oh, I don't know. I need I need to get my head around what I'm doing over the next few weeks. I don't want to jump the gun. Broken cliff there. So those aren't the forgotten ruins. This is something else. Uh oh. Wait. Let me listen to them. Are they... Interrogating him? Oh no, you're all adventurers. You guys are just lingering around this guy, not even helping them. Wow. Thank you. Tribunal mask silver added. Yay. Oh, is that the same guy? Yeah, looks like it. Uh-oh. Segra. Oh, he's got a unrelenting force shout. Jordan, it's not looking well. There we go. You'll be dead. Uh, 
I'm not sure I recognise that one. Jordis, my love. Sweetie, what is it? Yes, of course. I'm going to give you arrows as per usual. There you go. You lead. I'll follow. One more soul. Hang on. I've got 32 dragon souls. You know what I need to do? Right, three. So that's 29. 26 23 20 17 14 Shut up! <laughs> 11 8 and Five. That'll do for now. I, d I just got a whole bunch of perk points. Nine. Bloody hell. Okay. Um, what can I even use it on? I've, I've already spent so much. Revel in battle. Defiance also increases melee damage weapons by 3% for 10 seconds. This affects stacks. Uh, yeah, okay. And what's this one? Sprinting in combat increases the armor of allied people within... Oh, right, okay. Screw it. Feeling perky. <laughs> if wearing all heavy armor, take 75% less damage from attacks below 15% health. Or 20% if you are affected by rallying standard. Oh, what are these? Oh, yeah, I didn't really pay attention to a lot of these because it just involved a lot of yakking. Yeah, not too fast about that. But, shit. Let's look at the rest. So that was heavy armor. What about block? We go over here. Mocking blow. Power bashing with a weapon. With a weapon. Yeah. Infuriates living targets. Uh, a, shield isn't, a shield isn't a weapon, though, is it? Uh, what's this? Dragon tail. After a successful timed block, bashing the attacker within five seconds deals double damage. Sure. Uh, what's this? Timing streak. Oh. Oh, I can get another one of these. Performing three successful timed blocks in a row completes a timing streak. I don't know if I'll do that either. Hello, Celtic. The Guild of Puns just called. They're not very happy. They've revoked your punning linguist's license. That was, that was, Space's, pu that was Space's pun. Um, I cannot be held responsible for the puns that my mods make. Take You take no damage from attacks during a timed block as long as you have stamina remaining. Mm. That sounds pretty good. One-handed. Yeah, maces, axes, but I, I'm, I've gone with the sword. Crosscut. What's this? Into the dust. Repeated standing power attacks with a sword against a target do escalating damage if no more than three seconds pass between each. Stacks up to three times. Okay, I'm still... It's just too big a description. Slaying an enemy under the effect of Clash of Tampions restores 100 points of stamina. Do I have Clash of Tampions? Ah, this one. Okay. What's the one at the very top? Whenever you defeat at least four humanoids or animals in a single battle, I gain a permanent 1% bonus to one-handed damage. This effect stacks up to 20%. Bloody hell. Yes, please. Perks well spent. And they didn't require me leveling up. Some might consider that OP. I say balanced. Because I did have to kill the dragons in order to spend those points. Um, to get perks. 
Hello, what's this? Something... Oh. Oh dear. Adventurer Flamethrower. They... Be dead. And there's someone over here on fire. Frostbite Berserker. There appears to have been some kind of battle, but they killed each other in the struggle. Oh, wow. Oh, I see. He was part of your party, was he? It's not the wilds of Skyrim that I fear. It's what dwells within. Oh, that's cool. These guys are like twins. Look at that. <laughs> yeah. The ice twins. So every, what was it, every four enemies I defeat in battle, either humanoid or animal, I get 1% increase to damage. Jeez. Are ogres humanoid? Oh, no, wrong, wrong, wrong shell. fighting Merlin again. Of course you are. I shall be glad to put that behind me later on. What's this? The Lover Stone. Oh ho ho! Oh, ho, oh, ho. Hmm. oh shit! Oh, I'm going the wrong way now. I need to get to Forgotten City. Which I think is just in these mountains over here. Come along, gang. Here's someone having a chit chat up there. Oh, hello. Chicken on the road, chicken on the bridge. Oh, yo, chicken on a bridge. Chicken on a bridge on a turd ass afternoon. Oh, what a terrible sight to see. Chickens clucking and laying eggs now. Something, 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 chicken on a bridge. Oh, God, what happened here? Oh, the Vigilance of Stendar. They've been decimated. Oh, oh fucking hell! Fuck's sake, Kinia! Ooh, Amulet of Stendar! Yay! I'll just pretend that I didn't get made jump by... To... Oh, I've already got an Amulet of Stendar. For fuck's sake! It would have to be one that I've already got, wouldn't it? Hello, Kinia. How you doing? <laughs> no, you got scared. They're all carrying Amulets of Stendar. For fuck's sake. Carry something different, whatever you need. <laughs> Spooky fart, yeah. I wasn't expecting it. I was... I'm just trying to play the game. And then a sudden fart noise came by and I wet myself. I don't like it. I'm going to have to change my pants now. Oh, wait, I'm not wearing any. It's fine. How are you? I'm good, thank you. How is you? How was your stream earlier? Hello, Joe. Happy Saturday to you as well. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> uh, how's it going? Have, have you have you lowered your voice uh, since the video, Joe, or are you still being loud? <laughs> I love how loud music Joe has just become loud Joe now. Wait, are you goodies or baddies? Oh, they're 
Oh, they're trying to settle things for kind. Right. Uh, I think I need to get up there to get to the Forgotten City. You have calmed down a bit. Okay, good, good. That was great. I, I, yeah, I think I, I put a comment on the video. I do wish that I had um, watched it on mute first to play along. Or, or like, muted it, played it, and then gone back and watched it again to see what it was. To see if I was right. But maybe next time, eh? But yeah, please, everyone, do go and follow the J3 Boys. They have a YouTube channel as well. Excellent content to be expected across the board. Oh dear, what happened here? Oh, okay. <laughs> it was alive. This won't end well for you. Who are you fighting? Who are they fighting? Oh, whatever. I'll just carry on mountain climbing. You saw me mention that. That was a good idea. Rover was on the YouTube channel if you look hard enough. Oh, don't. That was a couple of years ago now, wasn't it? That, oh, no, sorry. No, it was, it was uh, this time last year, wasn't it? It was like... It was the Maybank holiday. Or just after it. But I... I look a state, if you ask me. Jeez. I need to be in another video to redeem myself. Giddy has seen it. Hey. Yeah, went went through the Bristol cave system. I showed them all my big cave. You're excited for round two? Oh, yeah. ka -ching. Greg and I still want to do that kind of Taskmaster video. Or just something with you guys. Which I think would be fun. But that, that would take some logistics, it would. Because you'd have to do each of your bits separately so that you all have a unique idea. That's generally how it works, isn't it? Never mind. Right. There is the Forgotten City. I'm hoping that entering the little cavern at the beginning, hanging out there for a bit, and then leaving will fix the music loop. This is just one idea that I saw on a forum, but we'll see how we get on. Oh, pipe down, you little drama queen. <laughs> yeah, that was it. What is the possibility of you making a journey this way? Uh, easy. I thought I could, I could do that easily. You know? Um, probably easier if I went to, like, Reading, for example, where, where you dropped me after your birthday thing last year. Because um, that, that's just really easy to get to from Bristol. Right. So I might... Uh, I might deliberately do a transform redeem just so I'm hanging out here for a while. And then hopefully the music will reset when I leave. Doable. Yeah, and, and obviously it depends uh, when as well. I am coming to London for a day trip on the 9th of June, but that's, to, that's mainly to see Transformers. But I think Jimmy and Adam are thinking of hanging out. You also very much enjoyed the cave we went down in Bristol. I bet you did. Yeah, it was fun, wasn't it? And for only a fiver to do that and the little observatory with the uh, the optical... What, what was it? It was like a reflection that used light to project an image onto a great big bowl. God, that was trippy, wasn't it? Especially when your eyes adjusted and suddenly everything became clearer. It was called a... Hurriedly Googling. Google that she... Can go down into the Forgotten Ruins if I wanted to. Oh, it's a dead skeever. Wonderful. Oh, uh. Panopticon? Was that it? Hang on. Panop Panopticon. Wait, the Panopticon is a disciplinary concept brought to life in the form of a central observation tower placed within a circle of prison cells. Oh, it's not a Panopticon. Vaulted Rune. Uh, hang on. 
Bristol Observatory. Here we go, Clifton Observatory. Come on. Camera Obscura. That's it. Camera Obscura. Yep, Camera Obscura. Uh, drink every time I say Camera Obscura. Is a darkened room with a small hole or lens at one side through which an image is projected onto a wall or table opposite the hole. Camera Obscura can also refer to analog anal analogous constructions such as a box or tent in which an exterior image is projected inside. There you go. This what it is. And it was very cool. Very cool indeed. Um, what, what else we do? We had burritos that day as well. I treated the boys to burritos because obviously I got out my thick burrito and slapped it on the table and they all went, whoa. Nice cut uh, burrito. Um, which was, uh, I think, I think you guys liked it. Yeah. We should go again. More burrito. Actually, better, yeah, I should make the burritos for you three, shouldn't I? Twas as thick as they say. Haha. <laughs> Quote, I just did my first tool mech. Yeah. <laughs> right, I'm hoping that coming here has reset the, uh, problem I was having with the music. Which wasn't really a problem, but I noticed it, and this is a potential fix. We'll see if anything changes. Okay. Now we go to Lakeview Manor. Let's go on our way. But yeah, Joe. Whatever plans you've got in place, if you've got room for a robo to join in, let me know. Hashtag for the content. I'm just waiting for the music to kick in now. I'll know instantly if the vanilla music plays straight away. That's all I really did that for. You shall. My man! Would be much fun. Absolutely. Absolutely. Oh god. It's like a whole goblin army over here. Goblin D's nuts, am I right? Did I get one of these? I'll get another one. Oh wait, your Serrano's resurrected one, aren't you? Oh, it's a um, Orcus Stronghold. Dushnik Jarl. Oh yeah, that's like the main one, isn't it?
Uh oh. Is it wolves and goblins? Looks like it. Hello. Oh, it is playing the vanilla music now. Yay! I fixed it. It's no longer looping the same music. I was distracted, but it, it is definitely happening. For some reason, it's just not playing the battle music right now. One-handed damage bonus increased to 1%. Ayy. Oh. You guys are fighting in the end. Wait, Jordis, don't be angry! You're my wife! I have had enough, thank you. <laughs> God damn. It's alright, soon she will semi-retire and live at home. Reachwind Airy. Oh. Can't use this while in combat. I'm not in combat. Who's angry? Oh, Skeevers. Okay. And and Draugr. Right, now can I dig that site? Oh, for fuck's sake! Now there's a fucking dragon! Come on, mate! I'm just trying to loot this thing! That's right, it's a mechanical one. These ones are easy. Look at that. Almost done. And dead. Right, finally. Dig, 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 dig. Yay. It's so bright out here. I don't know how you stand it. Yeah, yeah. Change the fucking record. Right, I need to get home, finish building this house. Then go to the last drummer convector. And then, bid farewell to Serana and Jordis. Oh my god. Oh, it breaks the heart. Uh oh. Wait, what have we got here? Vampires versus Ogre versus Adventurers? Where'd your mate go? Wait, I want to loot them. Where'd they go? Oh god, they killed someone. They might all be baddies, in which case it's fine. Mm. Oh no, it's Forsworn. Okay, that's fine. We don't mind when they go.
excuse me. Oh wait, there's someone angry with us back there? Who? Oh, I think Merlin might be fighting with them. Who could it be? Just an orc. An orc in Imperial garb. Oh, I'm not sure. I don't know. Might be an Imperial. Well, now I'm just wasting time. I don't know. Before I dismiss Jordis, I need to take the Cloak of Ysgrimor off her. And any other artifacts. Except Hope's Fire, because the one she's using is different to the one in the gallery anyway. Um, I think she's wearing ebony armour, which I might have to put in the gallery as well. We shall see. Any amulets? No. I've been hunting and fishing in these parts for years. It's not like my bagel. <laughs> oh, you've got no amulets for sale. Okay. Nice of that wolf to freeze in the air. While I conducted that little perusal of goods. Hey, one-handed increase to 2%. Our steps inside. We're not going inside, Sarana. Stop assuming. When you assume, you make an ass out of you and me. Oh. I need to get over there. Um... All right, fine. Going this way. You're dead. You want to hear something funny? You're dead. This won't end well for you. That's what I That bonus is going up pretty quickly. I think it's probably benefiting from the fact that I've got loads of extra monsters in the one of the mods. I 
don't know whether it counts undead. I guess that counts as inhuman, right? Or non-human. But they are human, they're just undead. A puzzle, I tell you. Oh, hello. You, you coming to get me? I've got all the saber cat teeth that I need. I don't need any more. I think we're good. Oh, hello. Now what? Hambulus! Hello. We've been fighting with hair mods all morning. Can someone just make an AIO with physics? And we can be done with it. I would if I could. But I can't, so I can't. I'm sorry. Other than uh, hair physics, how are things? Right, I think we're good. Cool. Oh, wait, there's more? Look at this guy. Look at him go. What a speed demon. Oh, they're fighting the dogs. Oh. I shouldn't have to do this to dogs, uh, but they're angry. I should have just used a calm spell, shouldn't I? Beautiful. Oh, are you. Okay, that's fine. Going well, you? Not bad, thank you. Uh, I've reached a few endings in this stream, which is bringing us closer to me being done with Skyrim for streaming, but still, still a few things to go. I'm. I'm Try not to get ahead of myself, but I am getting closer. I just need to... I need to fill the armory. It's one thing I want to do. Wait, where's the wounded? Wait, what are you doing up here when no one can see you? Outside a cave as well. Very sus. Thank you. Here, this is for you. It is good to see you again, my friend. Thank you. Actually, you might have an amulet on you. Take a look. You do not. I hate you. Go away. See ya. Fort Sungard Oubliette. Nah. Not going that way. You're just working on your mod collection. Same as yesterday and the day before. It's like a full-time job, isn't it? Every day you swear you're almost done, but you never seem to be. Yep, a modder's work is never done. If it's not what they say, it's what they will say from now on. Hot diggity damn. Oh. Oh, mate. Wait, he's still alive. Look, his tail. Just having to lie down, are you, mate? Yeah, that's fine. You have a lie down with your book. Oh, and the horse got yeeted. Wait! What the fuck? Serana, why did you resurrect a nude? Oh, it's a Forsworn, though. But why is the clothes missing? Serana, explain yourself. Why are her clothes missing? Yeah, see, even Merlin's pissed off. And Billy. Hmm? What are you got to say for yourself? Huh? Nothing? Oh. Oh. Yeah, it's weird, isn't it? Now she realises. Serana's lonely. She could be. We all know she was horny, horny for horny, horny for Valand. Maybe still is. We all we all saw what happened when Valand walked into that hot tub. That could have been a TOS moment with a few settings changes. Yeah, nah. I don't go in for that. Uh, although when I played Morrowind, this was not when I was streaming it. This is when I played it on my own. Um, off stream years ago I did install better bodies with the new option on it's high outside it's, it's, it's a warm night in Skyrim <laughs> oh there you go she's gone it's not just her clothes that have disappeared now her entire self has disappeared am I going the right way? I think I am 
<laughs> Lady with missing clothes. Rut row. What's this then? Is this your horse? Yep. Up you get. Go on. There you are. Well done, noble. Yes, Falkreath. We're in the right. We're on the right track. Hello there, adventurer. Okay. I used to be an adventurer like you. Then I got OP and now I'm practically a god. Oh. Oh. Wait, was he leaving an offering or... Oh! I'll take that. Thank you. No, it's not headstone. They're like uh, waystones, aren't they? Here we are, Lake Illinalta. And Lakeview Manor is on the other side. Can we even see it from here? No, not quite. T quick, summon the ultimate nudist, Big Jez. Oh, Chaotic, I'm not sure you were here when uh, we came across an apparition of Big Jez. Who was dead. We his body was dead. His body was dead? He was dead. And we found his body. I... I couldn't drag it for some reason. I think he was too heavy. But I used a dragon shout and I was able to blast him into the river to give him a good send-off. But the body disappeared. It's clipped. I don't know if it, I don't know if it was clipped on Skyrim or if it was a YouTube clip, but it has been clipped and it did happen. I think the clip is called We Were Trying to Have a Funeral or something like that. I get distracted because of a fight. But when I go into the water to check that the body is on its way, it disappears. Was that Sophia that stripped? No, it was a Forsworn Forager. Just a just a dead one. Um No, I haven't got I haven't got Sophia installed. If you do the mods command, it'll tell you what mods I've got installed. Ghost Jez. I mean, I believe that when Jez appears, it's always to guide us in some way. The first time it happened, I was I didn't know what was happening. And I experimented and I and I killed him then, but he came back. And after that, after every time since then he was helping us, there was that time when he was checking our butthole. He checked Valen's butthole and gave it a little scratch as well. I think those are YouTube clips though. They are in the clips channel, you might have to scroll for them though. Wait, are you a stormcloak? Yes. No storm cloaks on my watch. And dead. I really want Jez to miraculously appear in Sovngarde. That would be amazing. I'd be so lucky if that happened naturally. I feel like if I manually put him in Sovereign Guard to appear there when I go and fight Alduin, I feel like my reaction would be a giveaway that I manually put him there. So, I don't know, man. Or, or maybe he'll appear in um, Skulldafen or something. That would be just as good. What I would like to do at Skulldafen is spawn in um, Karstag, because every time I've used that power, it hasn't worked because I've been in the wrong place. I think it only works when you're in an exterior cell, like and in the main Skyrim, as well. Or, or actually, it might, I might even be wrong. Then it might be only in Solstheim. I'm not actually sure. Oh, I see. It's a Sophia bug. That's why you're asking. Okay. No, no worries. I, th I reckon I will play with the Sophia mod installed at some point. Because um, I've seen Simon Honeydew play with uh, Sophia. And it, it was pretty funny. Because, you know, she's got extra abilities, doesn't she? Like, she can you can get her to play instruments and sing for you, can't you? Yeah, one day. Maybe, maybe my darkest timeline playthrough. <laughs> Where everything is super sus. Alright, here we are. 
it's time to finish making Lakeview Manor. Brum, brum. Slow, 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 slow. It's all right. We'll speed up when we uh, are done. Oh, hello. Oh, you're an undead one, aren't you? Oh, Serana, don't bring him inside. He's just going to leave ash everywhere. I'm going to wait like three hours. Thank you. Oh, maybe he's carrying an amulet. He is not. I need to get a new chicken. I need to speak to Goldier and ask for a chicken. Seeing as the other chicken got killed. Right, here we go. I need to go to the upstairs work table foist. There's no better way to face the cold Skyrim nights than with a warm body to lay with. <laughs> Ow! Hubba hubba! Round. <laughs> Here we go. I can't make anything because. Oh, it's only in the basement, isn't it? I did need the saber cat teeth, but I think everything I need is in the basement. In the basement, people. Hi, Goldie. I mean, hi, oh, Goldie. Wake him. Excuse me. Shut up! We mustn't wake him. Oh, little, little Millie. I wish you could. I wish this dog mod let you name the dogs. What? There you go. We woke him up now. Right. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh. <laughs> okay. Uh, I guess there are some skeevers about. Including one that has disappeared? Oh, I, th <laughs> I think... I think one of the skeevers has glitched. Okay, never mind. Oh, for God's sake. I can't use that one in combat. Must be gone now. Yeah, fucking better have. Am I going to have to no-clip out to go and find out what happened to him? <sighs> okay, hang on. Should be directly beneath this spot. Okay. Um... I've lost the target. Target lost. Guess I'm going back up. Oh yeah, it has actually gone. Maybe it's um. Yeah. Okay. That was it. No oh, fuck off, Jesus. Ugh, like a moth or something. Shrine of Stendar, Shrine of Talos. RK, Debello, Julianus, Kinnereth, Zenithar. Can I make the amulets is the question I need to ask. No, I don't think I can. No. Ah, oh, that's crap. That would have been such a convenient shortcut. Never mind. Uh, I think that was it, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah, it's literally just the um, other amulets and then that's it. So, I'll put the fish in the fish tanks. And then that'll be it. I will consider Lakeview Manor done. I'm not too fussed about making all the shrines anyway. 
just secondary at this point. I will keep the list up, and I will find. I will get the amulets when available. And then what I can do is just drop in here every so often to make them. Here we go. Fish tank. I can put three more fish in this tank. Why is it not letting me put the fish in? How do I, how do I put the fish in? Do I just have to drop them in, or? Oh, it, for fuck's sake! Fucking idiot! Uh, have a brook bass and a salmon and a cod. Yay! Fishy! Yay! Beautiful. Uh, do I have small fish tanks? Yes, I do. Let's get some equal fish going. Uh, right. I have an Obesian longfin, a Cyrodiilic spade tail, a hist carp, and a river betty. You can't place that many fish in here. Okay, never mind. Just have those ones. Oh, this is great. This is so cool. Uh, have... And have have a have a silver side perch, a river betty, and an obesian longfin. Shush. Look, you're scaring the fish. Um, here we are. Carp, cod, salmon. And another carp. Oh, that's cool. A little boat in there. Fish tanks. Yay, I've got an aquarium now. <laughs> oh, that'll do. That's enough for me. Bit sad that they're in the basement. Oh, there you are, you little shit. Jordis, get him. Get him. Oh, darling. Stay on your guard. <laughs> what was that? I don't know, Jordis. A skeever, maybe? Like, right in front of you? Mm. <laughs> okay, well... Um, I think all there is to do is, uh, yeah, that's it. Every room has been completed, apart from the basement, but I'm going to write that off because the amulets are awkward to come by. Come, Jordis. Let us christen our new home. Hang on, let me just loot my own safe. Hidden knight. Is that because it was hidden? Come, Jordis. What, Jordis? Jordis. Wife! There you are. Come. Come. Let us rest for three hours. Let's get it on. Ah, I awaken feeling my lover's comfort. Get out of the way, Serana. Okay. Jordis, my love. Still here. I said that when the house was built... When I, I said when the house was built, um, I would... I would leave you here to look after the children that we're going to be adopting soon. <laughs> I think I have a replica of that so she can hold on to that. Um, yeah, ebony armor. No, you know what? Keep it. Keep all of these. But I will take this. Oh. Um, yeah, that's it. It's time for us to part ways, my love. Okay, if you say so. Oh, don't, safe, my love. don't say it like that. I can't let you follow me because for some reason, um, what's her name? Fucking Bladeswoman won't let me 
submit anyone to the blade when I've got multiple followers. I'll be saying goodbye to Serana soon as well. My heart can't take it. Yo, Goldie. Yes? Uh, I'd like you to make some improvements in the house. Certainly. What did you have in mind? I want a chicken. I'll see to it at once. Oh my god, should I get a bard? Certainly. What did you have in mind? Hire a bard, Goldie. It would be pleasant to have some music in the house. I'll make some inquiries about retaining the services of a bard. Thank you. I'd like to buy furnishings. Can I still buy furnishings for stuff? Of course. What room would you like me to furnish? Never mind. <laughs> Very good, sir. I. Oh, goodbye, Jordis. I love you. But soon we will have children. I will come back and I will visit them and I will say, "Here, I brought you uh, slaughterfish scales." Everyone loves slaughterfish scales. Right, and out here I will remove all the workbenches and then drop off all my building materials so that I'm free to run around fastly. Ooh, excuse me. Wait, I can't make ambulance here, can I? No. It was too good to be true. Right, armory. Wait. Oh no. Uh, cellar. No, keep the workbench. Remove the workbench from the main hall. Remove the workbench from the trophy room. There we go. Then. Um, I've still got that? Okay. Don't need. Oh wait, no. I will take the Dwemer cogs because I can use them to make Dwemer. Artifacts. Mm. Put the pelts away. Don't need those. Wait. Why did I buy the goat horns? You didn't need them, did it? Oh well. Keep the fragments. Drop the hinge. Um. Leather strips, nails. Okay, that's enough. Oh man, I'm really sad that Jordis isn't following us anymore, but I had to. And also, if we are going to adopt people, it's not people, children. It's not really very responsible of us to be like, yep, you're our kids, but you're going to be at home on your own all the time. We've got, with only Goldie looking after you. Right, yeah, this is where... This is where we're gonna find the next... Dwemer Convector. And also bid farewell to Serana. Sag. Where is Serana? Where'd she go? Oh, there. Okay. Hmm. Oh, fuck off, moth. You know, this morning I had to catch a moth and set it out, set it outside, and now I've got another one. Coming out of the goddamn walls. What's this all about, then? Ah, uh, you're fighting some banditos, are you? Mom, 
Moth is friend. Moth the lake of the lamp. I love lamp. Yeah, maybe. It hasn't landed on the ring light, though, and it hasn't landed on the other ring light. So if it does love lamp, it's very stupid. It doesn't know what a lamp is. Oh, they're fighting the bear. Okay. I imagine as I let go of each follower, enemy uh, like fighting is going to become uh, more risky because it's only going to be me in between dropping followers off. Who did I say I was going to recruit? Aranya, Jizago, and... Who was the third person? Was it, was it Teldrin at Solstheim? Is that who I said I would drop off? It wasn't Gold here. He's my steward. Um, I have forgotted. I've heard the Thalmor are capturing many prisoners here in Skyrim. Hmm. Oh, you know who we haven't seen for a while. Let's go and say hello to them. If I can remember their names. Uh. Right, Demented Elytra Nymph. Was that the one called Eli? And then this one... Manic. Manny the Manic Elytra Nymph, and then... Eli. Eli and Manny, that was it. Oh, what? Uh... Wow, okay. Apparently I've dropped off a whole bunch of crap here. I'll take those back and I'll put them in the gallery. Um. Oh, that's annoying. I've got some shrines to the divines here, but no amulets. Ah, oh, but yeah, these two were one of the first follower companions I had. They're very slow. And they didn't do much, but I, I love them. They are my friends. Uh, you, get out of the way. No. Um, no. Lower level is the display room. Okay. Maybe I should take them home. Take them to Lakeview Manor, maybe. Hmm. Just so they're not on their own. I forget how I would even do that. It, it, it would probably involve having them follow me again, but... Yeah, maybe later. Yeah, I think I've got a good plan now. I've straightened it out in my head. So, we're going to finish this little quest for Arniel Gain. Recruit members to the Blades. Aranya, Jizago, and whoever I said would be the third person. If anyone can remember, please let me know, because I've forgotten. Um, also, as I'm passing Windhelm, I'm going to adopt one of the girls there. And then when I go back to Solitude, I'll adopt the guy at the, um, whatchamacallit, uh, stables. Then once I'm done recruiting the blades, Valand is going to fly solo again, just like the very beginning. And that'll be finding out where all the artifacts are. And taking them to get to the museum. And then once that's done, it'll be time to fight Alduin.
But yeah, it looks like a lot of that is going to happen next week rather than today. All these Stormcloaks, not one of them are carrying an amulet for the Divines. Oh, fuck's sake. I'm going to have to say goodbye to Millie and Merlin as well, at some point. Nah, go big or go home. We're saying goodbye to everyone today. <laughs> Even Valand. <laughs> goodbye, Valand. Stop following me. Nah. I've been hunting and fishing in these parts for years. Cool story. Tell it again. Ah. Are all the Imperials going to be in the midst of a battle around this corner? Let's see. Place your bets now. Sometimes they are, sometimes they're not. They are... Mm... They are not in battle, but they are ready for it. Keep an eye out for trouble. It's only a matter of time. Mm-hmm. Yes? Oh, okay, they killed a Thalmor wizard. Another of Ulfric's boys. Oh, I'll tell you what I could do. When I um, finish... When when Valand is travelling around on his own again and all the blades have been recruited, I can bring out Milo, the very first pet. Because I said I was going to bring Milo into Sovngarde to fight Alduin with me, so... Yeah, I think that's what I'll do. Milo, who was a skeever, metamorphed into a saber cat and then went back into a, a skeever... <laughs> Completely unplanned. It just happened. And it was amazing. Okay, no, if I do it here, then I can just start heading north straight away. Yeah, I, th I feel like this is more convenient. So once this Dwemer Convector bit has been done, then I will, excuse me, say farewell to my beautiful friends. Oh, are we all fighting, are we? Wait, who are you? Are you injured or...? <laughs> okay. Nice of him to stand up so I could behead him. This is why I'm saying farewell to these guys. They keep fighting. Anyway, I'll sort out my business. You're not getting the best of me.
Not a bad combo for an outfit, actually. Fuck him up, Merlin. Let me sort this out. I can always ask... Oh. Have a, a goose companion. Could do. I did look up having a penguin companion. But I think, given how late I am into the game, I wouldn't get enough use out of it. Deliver the soul gem to Arniel. There we go. That's your lot. What's this? Oh shit, I forgot to go to Hottingbury Meadery. Oh bollocks. Um, okay, you know what? Never mind. Guys? Okay, just finish what you're doing, and then... Yeah, just... If you could just kill this guy. Stop arsing about and kill him. Okay. Right. Can everybody please meet me down here? Recruit a penguin and a goose, modify their stats, and call them Pingu and Shonk. <laughs> Maybe. Okay. Everyone? Everyone. <clears throat> Sorry, I'm role-playing as Valand. I'm just delivering a speech. Uh, so, everyone. Uh, you may have noticed earlier that I bid farewell to Jordis. She's going to stay and manage the house and look after the children that I am soon to adopt. But it's also time to bid farewell to... You three, Millie, Serana. Let's move faster. The sun is. It's not great for my skin, if you know what I mean. Right behind you. I'll be with the Dawn Guard if you need me. Yeah, you you go now. Goodbye. Goodbye, Serana. Bye. Goodbye. Yeah, just trip that when you leave. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, it's not a trip wire. It's a. Oh, never mind. Right, <clears throat> um, oh, Millie, you're so cute. Just la just last week or the week before, I was watching the clip when I first found you, and I flappy handed and everything. Serana jumping the gun, yeah, she wanted to leave, but Millie, it's time for you to go back home. Oh no, don't whine at me, please. <laughs> Wah! Oh, just look at that. Homeward bound. Wait, Merlin, you go with them. Uh, wait for me at home. Lakeview Manor. Nice. Goodbye, Merlin. Oh, look at him. <laughs> oh, look at him go. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, they're both travelling together. Oh. Well, they're both getting stuck on the stairs together. Mustn't get emotional. Mustn't get emotional. It's just me and you now, Aranya, and that's because I'm delivering you to the blades. <laughs> you are the weakest link. Goodbye. Interrupts inter crack, Interrupts you right up until the end. That's us, Aranya. Yep. Fucking hell. Oh. oh. My heart. How long have they been travelling with us? I mean... <laughs> Thank you. Fucking hell. Aranya, what do I do? I've let all my friends go! Because the mod won't let me fucking submit anyone to the Blades when I've got multiple followers. Actually, I don't even know if that's the real reason. All I know is, I had multiple people following me. I have the quest update to bring people to Delphine to recruit them to the Blades. It wouldn't give me the dialogue option. Someone in chat suggested it was because I had multiple followers. So that's the only reason I'm saying goodbye to these guys. It does make sense when you think about it. Because if they're all following me, it's like, well... you know, How do you choose which one to recruit? Whereas, if it's only one person, then you can't really... You did time that badly. 
And I hope you feel not proud of not proud of yourself. Oh man. Oh. Um. Hmm. Looks like he logged off. Okay, so here we have Ivar's dead. <laughs> um, I need to get to Honningbrew Meadery. Um, Wait, I know you. No, you fucking don't. Shut up. Idiot. Ah, oh, this it's not the same without Merlin's little barks. Jordis saying, Oh darling, you're the only stone something knuckle dragging Nord for me. <laughs> the humble woodcutter, yeah. I'm gonna go around. Uh, um, what's the most convenient way of doing this? I can either go there, 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 and then there, or there, 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 there. Okay, I, I think the second option is already better. Windhelm. Let's go. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! Oh, it just fucking launched itself into the stratosphere. Bloody hell. And it died. Amazing. Oh, I wish I had tracked it all the way through the air. <laughs> oh, man. If only Jordis was here to see that. <laughs> Don't cry, don't cry, don't cry, don't cry, don't cry, don't cry, don't cry. I've just been so deeply immersed in the game. And Jordis is my go-to gal when I play when I play Skyrim. What can I say? So many hours spent. And then I just have to say, it's time for us to part ways. And the way she responded! Uh, oh, okay, if you're sure. I'll be at home then. <laughs> I didn't mean it that way, Jordis. I hope you understand. To be honest, I could have let her come with me while I recruit the children and then be like, Yo, Jordis, go home. But, too late. She's gone home first. Oh, who's left the bloody gate open again? For God's sake. There we go. Born in a fucking barn. Oh, hello. Watch out. Watch out. The Draugr's about. Whee! Oh yeah, that one's dead. Oh, or not. Oh, they killed the Imperial! Ooh, potatoes. Are you a bandit? Yes.
8% damage now. Alright, well done, guys. Well done. Oh, God. He's like the last Imperial out of this little battalion, this little unit. Oh, dear. Oh, God, they all got all fucking wasted. Bloody hell. Oh, well. Excuse me? Oh, hi. Go on, fall, da fall down the mountain so that you get die from fall damage. Yeah, that's it. Wait, I need to loot you. Oh, the other one has only just got to the bottom, look. <laughs> Beautiful. Twenty-five minutes to get to Windhelm and adopt someone, and then to Arniel Gain and get blank. And I reckon by that time it'll probably be finishing time. Oh crikey! Then I'll be in the end game. I think off stream I might just quickly hop on, go to the gallery, find out what um, artifacts I want to get, and make a, make a list of what they are and where I can get them. And that'll be what we do next week, along with um, recruiting people to the Blades. Whoa, this guy's cornered. Well, surrounded, not cornered. More of them, fucking hell. Oh, and they killed a rabbit. Whee! Oh, you'll have your chance. You'll be with the blade soon. Cool. Yeah, that's something else I'm going to have to do. I need to go to... Um, uh, Cloudhaven Temple. And speak to Delphine and say, Yo, you want this one? Should get over to Windhelm more. See how the other Morrowind refugees are getting along. Yeah, don't worry, mate. We're we're heading over there now. You can do just that while I adopt a child. Ooh. Shrine. Shriney. Right. Windhelm should be just over here. Oh, what happened over there? Two Spriggan patriarchs? Matriarchs? They're, they're matriarchs, you can tell, because 
You can tell. Oh, nearly. I like to imagine that it, it tried stamping on me, but it stamped on my shield, slipped, and that made it fall over. Can't quite see it from here, but we are close. Whee! I just realised something else. I'm going to be adopting a child, and obviously Jordis isn't here. She's not going to have any idea. And then this kid is going to appear on the doorstep. Uh, yeah, your husband said that you're my parents now. <laughs> I think I've done this in the wrong order. Never mind. Let's just assume that in Valen's closing speech, he told Jordis that he was going to send a child to come and live with us, alright? And that's why Jordis is staying at the manor to, like, make everything child-friendly, you know? Hi, Ogre. He's angry. <laughs> what are you doing in my swamp? There it is. You can just see the walls of Windhelm from here. Come, Aranya. Let us swim. You know what this game is missing? Like, fast swimming. Like, holding down sprint to fast quicker. Holding down sprint to swim faster. Not fast quicker. Fuck. <laughs> Go fast quicker. God. Explain the Flash's superpowers. Uh, he goes fast quicker. <laughs> there we are. Got shit on the monitor. Not shit, I mean just stuff. I think this should be just about timed right. Unless Arniel Gain has any more things for us to do. But I don't think there is. I think it, like, everything comes in threes, you know? The first thing was the cogs, the second thing was that spear, and the third thing was this uh, soul gem. And then he should be done, and we should get the thing that he has. Okay, I think I think she sells flowers by the docks, so let's head over there. I'm a sailor on the north wind. We're laying over in wind. Cool story. Is she at the docks or is she? I bu I bumped into her out here once. Uh, I can't remember her name. Ah, there you are. No one bought any flowers again today. I don't know what to do. Well, don't worry, Sophie. I'm, I'm so cold. Oh, who are you? Who are your parents? They're, they're dead. <coughs> My mama died when I was little. I, I don't remember her very well. Oh, mate. My father was a stormcloak soldier. Uh, uh. He left and didn't come back. I'm all alone. I, I try to sell flowers so I can buy food. 
It's not much, but what else can I do? Uh, I could adopt you if you want. Really? Do you, do you have a place I could live? Hell yeah, I do. What are you doing? Uh, <laughs> no, I don't. Yes, I've got a house in Falkreath. Oh, wow. Are you, are you sure? You really wouldn't mind? Yes, I'm sure, daughter. Yay! Thanks, Mr. Um... <laughs> Mr. Papa. You'll be the best daughter ever. Ah. Yay! Ah, oh, wasn't that wholesome? Wasn't that wholesome? Uh, yeah, you're drinking, you're celebrating, yay! I need to get my things and say goodbye to everyone. I'll meet you at home. Thanks. Thanks so much. Yay! Happy days. I'm a sailor on the north. Wind. Shut up. We're laying over in Windhelm. Stop ruining my moment. Now you can call him Daddy Valand. Wait, no, don't call him that. Should have gone out via the docks entrance. That would have been slightly quicker. Never mind. Skyrim isn't very friendly for our goblins, so we must have just been They really missed the trick by not adding Khajiit and Argonian and Orc and Dark Elf. Basically any child that isn't human. They should have added those. They should have added non-human childs. Childs? Children. Murr. You know what I mean. That'd be great. Especially, like, because of how racist Windhelm is. Like, adopting a little Argonian kid. That'd be great. would be like, hey, kid, you don't have to live here with these racists. Come live with me. <laughs> Thank you, Space. Yeah. Hmm. Or, like, go to Solstheim and there's, like... A little lost dark elf child whose parents were killed in the red year or something. Although they're long lived, but do they age slowly? I don't know. Well, yeah, I mean, imagine if you're playing like an old character and you adopt like an adolescent. That would work. I did think it a bit awkward though when she said my father was a Stormcloak soldier. He left one day and didn't come back. Meanwhile, Valand is like a big Imperial logo emblazoned on his back. Um, oh, <laughs> yeah, no idea. Who knows what happened to him? It's a real mystery. <clears throat> Everywhere I've wanted to get an amulet, there aren't, there aren't any. I take it Aranya's still keeping up. Oh, I'm going to miss Merlin running along, turning himself into fire, or ice, or shock thing. Oh, I can get rid of this now. There we go. I'm going to miss Millie slowly catching up and then arriving long after the battle is over. I'm even going to miss Serana with her... Anyway. Um... Ah! Ah, oh, you bastard! You get it? See what I did there? Because it's a bear. And it's a bastard, so I called it a bastard.
but above all, I'm going to miss Jordis traveling with me. Every, every so often saying something that just makes Valen to go rock hard, you know? <laughs> no. There is the College of Winterhold. In distance. We will see what Arniel Gaines' endeavours will result in. Oh, excuse me. Fuck off. Sorry, the moth is back. What if it's the same moth that I threw out earlier? Long stream tonight. Eh, Jesus, Eddie, you can tell you've not been around for a while. I do Skyrim for six hours every week now. And I always finish at 10.30, you know this. Hashtag fake fan. Bedtime Robo. What, you mean Robo Bedge? Nah, not yet. Damn, I'm sorry. Fucking better be! Faker? Nah. <laughs> no, I'm just messing with you. Yeah, I mean, Morrowind and Oblivion were always four-hour streams as per usual, but I love Skyrim that much that I was like, you know what? I'm going to put six hours into Skyrim every week. And as a result, it is the longest playthrough of a single game that I've done. Um, it's the longest I've played Skyrim ever. I'm pretty sure by now. Um, if it beats a thousand hours, then I think, yeah, definitely. Um, I need to check my Steam stats for that. Uh, what else? Um, yeah, it's just been a real long adventure, you know. But of course, with it being my favourite game, I had to. I, 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 I wouldn't, it wouldn't have felt right, you know. Okay, looks like Arniel is in the Arcanium. Okay. What's he doing there? He wonders. Oh, Arniel. Arniel, darling. I've brought you your trinket. Hmm. Mm. You are? Divines bless you. May the ground you walk quake as you pass. May I help you, Archmage? I have your gem. I mean, gem. It worked, then. Let me see. Goodness. That's it, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Yes. It's not perfect, but it's a close enough approximation that it should certainly suffice for initial tests. You've done excellent work here. Truly excellent. There's only one thing missing now, and that should be arriving shortly. I'll begin preparations. Thank you again so much for this. All right then. Okay. Greetings, Archmage. Good to see you. Oh no, that's it. Okay. I do actually have to wait for him to reach out to me to say, "Hey, I'm ready. Come hang out." Greetings, Archmage. Hi, Finis. So in that case, um. I will start making my way back to the gallery, but ultimately, there are deep we are pretty much done for the day. That incident in Morthal was just a misunderstanding, no matter what the guards claim. Uh, sure. Right, what did I say I was going to do next? Oh no, I need to head to Hodding Brew Meadery, don't I? 
Yeah. So I'll travel there, then go northwest to the to Solitude, and after that I will come down and recruit Aranya to the Blades. Where's Temple? There. There we go. That's the three-step plan for next week. Gallery. Sorry, Honing Brew Meadery. Gallery. Recruit Aranya. Oh, and adopt a kid from the stables at Solitude. I remember names. I've just adopted Sophie. With an F. Sophie. I reckon... I think Skyrim might be over before... Maybe before July? I don't know. Maybe even during July. It'll be a summertime finish, I think. I really don't know for sure. Hmm... Over the next week, I'm going to assemble a wish list of stuff to get and where to get it from, including the fake cards, if I can confirm that. I feel like I've been to so many places now and these cards just aren't appearing. I think they must be somewhere, somewhere specific and unique. Um, unless I've just been very unlucky and they haven't been spawning. Oh, hello. What's that? Oh, it's uh, Reeklings. Beautiful. <laughs> oh, I love it when that happens. <laughs> Turn around. <laughs> oh, man. Amazing. One of the other clips I recently edit edited for the clip show was the one where Potato gets thrown into the air by a giant. I never saw him land. He just went up into the sky and never came back. Oh. <laughs> uh, of course, he did come back, but, you know. Ah. Uh. Oh, God, now what? Whee! Now slide down here. Oh, or not. Bye. This is a good place to have a pit stop. It's the northern outpost for the Explorers Guild. Northern Field Station, yeah. Come, Aranya. Sit. Is she going to sit? Come on. I don't, I don't want to have to tell you. Let me just pick up this gold. Oh, shit. Okay, hang on. Let me pick up the gold and then we'll have a sit down. There we go. Sit down. Come on. That's it. Oh, I'll just start... Okay, fine. Oh, she's getting firewood. Okay, she understands. Cool. Well... Oh, man. The end of Skyrim is in sight. 
but as I said, still got a few things I need to do. I'm going to draw up a shopping list of things that I want and how to get them. We're recruiting people to the Blades. We've still got to speak to Orion about the Deep Holm stuff. Um, I've got to wait for Arneel Gain to tell us about what he's doing. So there's a few little miscellaneous bits to do. But otherwise, as Doctor Strange said, we're in the end game now. It's heavy, man. It's heavy. I love this game. And I've been at it for so long. Hey, welcome back, Tin. Just in time. Last Jedi watched. Okay, what did you think? And how would you compare it to the other Star Wars movies? Eddie's interested to know what you think about Last Jedi. <laughs> back just in time. Yeah. Snap. And this is good because it's taking ages to close the game. Thank you for Stribbage. You're welcome, Chaotic. You're welcome. Personally, Eddie hates The Last Jedi. <clears throat> Eddie's young, Tim. Just, he doesn't know what he's saying. He hasn't, he hasn't fully developed yet. <clears throat> You've seen them all before, but personally, you think it's one of the best ones. Thank you. Thank you. I always knew that my hard-on for you was right. <laughs> ah. See, Eddie? It's not just me. Apologies for the massive glow-up. Um, the mod organiser is still open. Now I can close it. Oh, jeez. Skyrim coming to an end. That means I'll be going back to four-hour streams. Because when I do Tamriel Rebuilt, which is the next thing I'll be doing... Um, man. My Saturday evenings will get shorter. <laughs> Only a true Sith Lord could say such a thing. Wow. Yeah, Eddie, Eddie's full of Sith. <laughs> no, you're not. You're fine. Um, all right, what's happening next week? So, Minecraft Monday. M Minecraft's back after a two-week hiatus because I was away last week. But it's going to be Menagerie May Minecraft Edition. Finishing taming the dragon. Um, and just finding animals. I've made some pens to raise some animals in or bring some animals to them. I'll be... It's just going to be a chill hangout time assembling some animals together, which is going to be good fun. Uh, then on Wednesday, it's Bee Simulator. And then on Friday, it's Cow the Kangaroo. And if anyone's interested, you can pick up the free remake of Cow the Kangaroo on the Epic Games Store. Um, only for a limited time. I think it's from the 4th to the um, 11th, I think. Something like that. They usually only have them for a week. Uh, then yeah that's it then more Skyrim next week and The Mummy 1999 for the movie morning next week the Canto Blight part is just so contrived and preachy I think it raises a very good point in that you know funding the conflict between the resistance and the first order yeah you are going to get people who are just there to profit so and and like this gambling ring being like, I I I like I think that's fine. You think a lot of people hated that Luke wasn't actually there battling against Kylo Kylo Ren. That's one of the best bits. That's so cool. It's so much more symbolic than if he was actually there. And it, like that bit where he's just like, <laughs> fucking amazing. It's exactly what drives Kylo Ren nuts and keeps him distracted. It's perfect. Boss, Ed, Boss Eddie, Boss Eddie, you love the mummy, the movie. No, the egg mummy. For the movie morning, Eddie. It's just an egg. It's just an egg with mummy written on it. Yes, Eddie, that one. The one with Brendan Fraser. BB-8 was so good in this film as well. BB-8's awesome. Although, not as good as BD-1 or R2-D2. But, eh. The Mummy movies are some of your favourites. Uh, we are only doing the first two, The Mummy and The Mummy Returns. Um, Space Bunny will tell you that the third one, Tomb of the Dragon Emperor, or whatever one it's called, doesn't exist. <laughs> Space doesn't, doesn't believe it exists. It's a myth. It's a mystery. It's false. It's fiction. It never happened. It's not true. <laughs> 
uh, Jonathan Frakes montage compilation, whatever. What third film? Exactly. <laughs> it's a conspiracy. You love your round little BBA. Oh, is that what you call it, Tim? Oh. Right, shall we find someone to raid out? I'm just waiting for Twitch to load. There we go. Live ASMR. Cozy triggers. Now you're alright. Um, what have we got here? Do -do 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 -do. Kiesco is live playing Alt F4. Awesome. We're going to raid Kiesco. I'm not sure I've had a chance to raid into him since he got back into streaming, so now is the chance. I mean, I, I could be wrong on that, but we'll see. Uh, I think I'm due to play some Phasmo with Kiesco tomorrow. Kiesco's still going. Yep, yeah, way ahead of your space. Way ahead of you. Thank you all so much for watching the Skyrim stream. Here are your raid messages. Please do post this into Kiesco's chat and give him a follow. He is a UK expat. He is now living in Canada. That's Canada to you and me. Um... Yeah, he does a lot of uh, challenge runs. Usually, um, I think recently he accomplished a Dark Souls 2 Deathless run. Um, yeah, he likes his Dark Souls. He like he likes the games that make him rage. <laughs> uh, Alt F4, clearly being one of them. I've already seen the You Die message so many times. You're fine, Eddie. You've got time. You got time. And we all have time to go and say hello to Kiesco. Um, yeah, I will see you guys on Monday for the Minecraft Monday stream. See you then. Have a wonderful rest of your weekend and a good week. Farewell. He jumped. Oh no. <laughs> Try not dying. Bravo, I appreciate your your input. I I've been dying a lot.